tribute to their queen. I need her to leave. Eventually. I'm sorry, I gotta knock you out. Excellent. You're not dead. You're messed up. You're actually trying to get it up before you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's play the game. Can you hear the game alright, yeah? I changed everything about my setup. So just getting used to everything again. How's the new monitor? I'm not gonna lie, right? N not great. Let's just watch just a sec and I'll tell you why. Nino's being horny in the Discord. Nino. Well, it's official. What even is this the fucking cutscene? The client has given us carte blanche. Hunt down the militia by any means necessary. A week ago, Providence was a threat. You can the scan the barcode on the back of his head to get a 5% off coupon for hand lotion. 47. A blank check is hard to turn down. Besides, the shadow client's war on Providence is causing a global panic. Someone will need to stop the militia. Might as well be us. And the man on the train? I see for the second game, they sacked off the cutscenes and went for like freeze frames. Taking a contract for personal gain is against ICA regulations. Yeah, this is jarring. Soldiers would have been proud. Is that a sense of humor? 47. Whatever next? Crying at the movies? Why are you doing this? I know what it's like to have everything taken from you. Is her... He claims to know about your past. Are the windows the of that building everything also screens on the outside? Can you trust him. About as far as I can throw him. Oh, it is. But this is our best lead in 20 years. Maybe, or something's being projected on it. Time we break a few rules. I actually have no idea. <sighs> Let's begin. Good afternoon, 47. Afternoon? Your destination is the annual Global Innovation Motor Race in Miami, Florida. After analyzing the data from Maynard's computer, the case is clear. The Providence defectors are Robert and Sierra Knox. Head it's of time to kill, boys. Kronstadt Industries. A visionary inventor... Restream chat froze. I was wondering why you guys are being Robert so fucking Knox quiet. God damn it. Kronstadt Industries <laughs> to the bleeding edge of technological development. This is banging. His equally brilliant daughter, Sierra, is not only a financial wizard, but also Shame there's so much sugar in it. competitive race car driver with a fiery temper to match. This game's one player, right? Yeah. Kronstadt enjoys enormous popularity Ooh. with global consumers. Robotics. However, what was the drink? It was Madagascan Cola. One of the world's leading suppliers of next-gen military tech. Last year, despotic ruler Jin Po employed prototype Kronstadt drones against peaceful civilian protesters in the now infamous Tungyan Valley incident. And although it has yet to be proven, there is little doubt that the Noxes personally brokered the deal, making them complicit in a war crime. Splashed. It is unclear why the Noxes would betray their masters. Can I fly your calls? Likely. The fear of being Did I? Next, on the shadow client's hit list has pressured them to cut a deal with Yo, look at that bullet. Fucking missed. Hit him in the head. That's not what you're aiming for. That's not going to kill anyone. Increase their attacks tenfold. And so our contract obligates us to retire Robert and Sierra Knox and contain the nose mend on our brains. On Providence. I will leave you to prepare. Hell yeah. It's time, boys. You said robotic. Ah, you got you got to know that when words come out of my mouth, I immediately forget what the fuck I just said. Um, oh wow, I actually can't bring any gear this time. I actually like that. All right, let's uh, let's go. Yeah. So the, this monitor, right? I went in and I was like, okay, I could just buy a 1080 monitor 
120 hertz, whatever, in a rush. And then I was like, or I can just get a really top end monitor. So I ended up getting this one, which is a it's a 4K monitor, 170 hertz. The weirdest fucking number ever. Why 170 hertz? I have no idea. But that doesn't matter to me because the capture card in this PC cannot output anything higher than 120 hertz anyway. But oh, what the fuck is this? A formula track? <laughs> anyway. I was like, I, I plugged in the monitor, and the first thing that happens is all the blacks on the screen uh, are like, they're like blue. There are blue lines going through it, like a, like a fucking old-style monitor. And the only way to fix it was to turn off adaptive sync. Then I turned the screen off, turned it back on. The same problem happened, and to get rid of it, I had to turn on adaptive sync. And I was like... It's another one of these, for fuck's sake. Either way, it's working now. But it's not in 4K. It's in 1080p at 120 hertz. Kind of an expensive ass screen that I can't use properly yet. But I'll have to like fiddle with it over the next few days. Oh, this level. I remember someone taking on the task of killing everyone on the map. Ex fucking excuse me? The better question is, why isn't the Hertz 170, but why any monitors Hertz are not weird numbers like 151.51? I don't know. I, I don't... The, I, I find monitors confusing. Because you have to, like, match up Hertz and FPS and all that shit. How much it cost? £560. <laughs> I'm not exactly happy about that, bad boy. I gotta sit closer. So anyway, this is the first stream in the new setup. So, if anything fucks up, my bad. Also, I need to turn up my uh, my earphones. I was a lot of my friends at 69 and chill. Shailen, there's no way. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry, frisk me, frisk me. Yeah, it touched me up. Oh boy, look at this place. Okay. Now, I'm not going to lie, and you guys are not going to find this surprising in the slightest. I didn't listen to what I was supposed to do. Kill two people. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. I don't know why, but that looks minging to me. It doesn't look like water. It looks like jelly. You feel me, boys? Oh, yeah. Now this is pod racing, boys. Let me just repeat some ground rules for those of you new to endurance racing. There's no way. <laughs> okay. There's two things I want to do, right? One, I want to drive a Formula car and cause him to crash and die. However, I also want to see if I can shoot a bullet in his face while he's driving. Ah, the duality of man. <laughs> oh, let's go. All right, first things first. How do I get on the track? This is amazing. I'm gonna key or crowbar or lockpick. Okay. I gotta try and remember how to do any of this shit. Alright, let's see. There's turbocharged. The munchies. 
A triumph? I want to drive. Okay, that's a weird one. Oh wait, this is the this is the infamous costume. <laughs> Let's go do it. So I think it's across the track, isn't it? Do you reckon I could just jump the fence and run? Okay, I think we're gonna have to go on. We're gonna have to go down. We're gonna have to go into parking, I reckon, and just cross. <laughs> Dude, I'm so fucking hyped. Got in a band band, eh? Excuse me. Gave me some sort of vitamin hydration boost, normally reserved for the drivers. Fix me right up. What? From Bang Bang. No, oh, you guys are thinking of Ban Ban Bird, yeah. Although it did kind of look like the Tour de France in there, what with all the syringes and IV stands. I think Sierra Knox had an appointment in there as well. Didn't meet her though. Shame. I hear she's fun to be around. Park another. <laughs> Are you with me? I'm here now, ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Yeah, after the race. I just gotta pick up the documents from my van, but um. Just gotta pick to up the documents from my van. Flamingo outfit, and now I can't find my car keys. Yeah, I know it's dumb. I think I lost them in the scuffle, but the real mascot is still over there. If I don't get them, I've got. No evidence. Buy by money. I don't know. I, I, I need to figure something out. Talk soon. What the fuck are you doing? Hey, hey, can you do me a favor? Oh, I can do you a favor, mate. My keys are over there. Yeah. The guy's crazy, and I don't dare go over there. But you look pretty tough. Why? No problem, mate. Also, sorry about the lighting in this room. I, I got a new light in the set, but it's not ready yet. Where is he? Where's he gone? Hey, yo, did you find some keys over there? Should we give him the keys? <laughs> you just can't ignore a man like that, yeah. Do that sinister goblin laugh while you choke him out. <laughs> ah, yes, the big old van. I got the incriminating evidence. Disguise yourself as the mascot. <laughs> <laughs> He's blocking the handicap parking. Oh, he has this coming. Oh man, you're a real lifesaver. Thank you. All right, where we going, bud? You fucked up. You proper fucked up, mate. You proper fucked up, mate. The problem is, when is a good time to take you down? Because this is security. There's two guards there. How are you, sir? It's too late now. It's too late. Let's just wait. Let's just watch him. He's going to be like, wait, where's my stuff? All right. Let's get this over with. Oh, what? I'm sure it put me. I must have fallen down my... What the hell? No way. No way, man. The documents are gone. How are they gone? Well, that's it then. You big idiot. I can't believe it. God, he's gonna kill me. <laughs> Should I avoid the camera? Do we care? There's nowhere to hide his body. Huh. Let's just see where he goes. This map is big, by the way. I, I fucking love this about Hitman. 
These maps are huge. Have I played the biggest map in the game yet? Oh, really? Oh, shit. This is the biggest map. Let's go! Wow, they, they started off Hitman too strong then, didn't they? Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck. Is Ted Mendez, one of the what? country's most influential military grade oh. money men. This must be connected to Kronstadt. <laughs> um, you are invading my personal space, sir. Uh... Think, 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 think. Mission story revealing. Where? Phil, it's Ted ah. here. Just returning your call before heading over to the exit. Subdue and toss into the sea? The I might have to, yeah. I need this guy to leave. No, not yet. I'm letting him stew a little. The guy's a genius and you know what they're like. Desperately lacking any discipline or respect for other people. The last time I tried to have a meeting with him, he had me sitting in a room for four hours before canceling. I'll head up my feet. <laughs> All right, I'll call you after the presentation. Speak then. Probably gonna beat him, uh, beat up the flaming on the garage. Yeah, yeah. I know. Hindsight's twenty twenty, you know. I wanted to see if he go like somewhere super discreet. Give me a little fuck. There's no way I'm gonna be able to do this in broad daylight. Sorry, man, but you're just making me feel a little uncomfortable now, okay? Okay, here's the plan. You might need to die. Looking good, man. Looking good. Thanks. You wanna fuck? Maybe if I had, like, a banana or something. <laughs> One of the comical ways of going out. Okay, he's... He's gone. It's flamingo time. Save first? Nah. Hmm? Oh, get the fuck! Okay. All right, um. 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 Uh. The race is entering its final lap, forty-seven. Come on, man! Go over the edge, dude. <laughs> Oh, there's a, there's a dump button. <gasps> I can't even get to him anymore! Mate! Ooh, a parking ticket. Have I got any... Ah! Wrong button. How do I... How do I get into my stuff again? I haven't played in ages. Was it P? No. O? L? E? R? The race is over. Sierra will be coming off the track any time now. Aha! <laughs> okay, go, 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 go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Hey, don't go that way, okay? Love you. Bye-bye. Well, what we'll do is we'll play this mission again because I absolutely want to go in an F1 car. <laughs> it goes to show how fucking slow I am. <laughs> uh. Wait a minute. What? Oh, it's these guys. Hey, idiot. Okay, goodbye. Hey, 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 hey. 
Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a s nice costume. You must think I'm stupid. Get out of the way. I'm getting the guards to deal with this evolutionary Oh, he stole the costume from him. Oh fuck, I understand now. Shit! Well, you know, it is what it is. Okay, the meeting area and play the part. I'm gonna play the plot. Wait, you ca I can't open it from this side? What even is this room? You know what? It doesn't matter. Just gotta find my way around. Hi, buddy. Ugh. Grim. Smart Kaif moment. So smart. How can a grown man degrade himself like that? I mean, look at that costume. He's still yeah. I'm a VIP, baby. Yeah. All right. Let's fucking go. Sorry, sir. I can't let you through. Got my orders. What do you mean? I'm the fucking VIP. Bruh. I need to move this camera as well, by the way. Let's go this way a bit. Yeah, there we go. Oh, how are we going to get in there? How are we going to get in there? Employees only? I should be an employee. Oh. Fuck it, we'll go in anyway. Sir, you're going to have to leave. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry. I'm leaving. 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 Okay. Clearly. You're trespassing. Please turn around, sir. Oh, thank God. I need some help, please. Maybe I can distract him. <laughs> the hell would you guys ever wear a t-shirt of somebody's face not mean Ooh, look at this I'm not I'm not trespassing you, okay. Is this a question or a merch idea? It was a question. <laughs> nice outfit. Really brings out your eyes. <laughs> Thank you. you be here. She has to make sure you brought the documents. So if it's a group of SR's face, fair. The papers right here. Excellent. Come on in. Have a seat or something. I'll let Miss Knox know you're here. So far so good from Jason. Now. Let's so, see where this meeting is headed. Is the guy here wearing the mascot outfit claiming you have an appointment with him? Do I? Got it. I'll let him know you're on route. Hey, Flamingo guy. Yeah, what's up? Miss Knox is on her way. Grab a seat somewhere. She'll be here as soon as she can. Miss Knox is on her way. Take a seat somewhere. All right, let's see. Let's go here. No. You say take a seat, but it won't. What if I sit over here? Whatever. All right, where's our target? Where are they? Oh, they're coming here. Okay, think, 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 think. How are we going to pull this off? How are we going to pull this off? There's no accidental killing around here. Fuck, we'll just meet up. We'll see what happens. We shouldn't help because it's funnier this way. Yeah, just uh, leave it to me. Leave it to me. Let's see what happens.
It's a backup plan. <laughs> how do I... How do I go to unarmed? Anyone know? Like, I don't want to be holding anything. H. I don't think I can sheaf this shovel, come to think of it. Oh, thanks, mate. <laughs> hey, you! You just dropped that shovel! Oh. Alright, this is my target. Oh, sure. Oh, I thought it was a woman. So, Mr. Hmm. I never did. Oh, it is the woman. Name. Names are for friends. I'm dumb. Straight to the point and all business. Walk with me. Where are we going? Don't worry. What am I gonna do? Kill you in broad daylight. I just want a bit of privacy here. Not about to do sensitive business like this in front of an audience. Good idea. You guys alright with me having a shovel in this meeting? Sorry, I don't mean to bump into it. I'm in a flamingo suit! Oh. somehow found internal reports that show Kronstadt's involvement in the Tungan Valley Massacre. Yes. Let's be clear. You and I are having this meeting because my father doesn't need to know about this. It's just another undesired distraction. You need to I don't stop care if the information right now, is true or false. I don't care if it mentions moving money from the Nexus Project into Tungan Valley Damage Control, as you claimed in your correspondence. I do care about protecting my father, which is why you and I are now here. I see. Leave me alone for a few Sir, minutes, guys. I would strongly advise you to quit it. You're freaking me out. So here's the thing. <laughs> you hand over the documents and leave, and that's the end of it. And you will do that now. There you go. So here are the two possible outcomes of this meeting. One, you will leave this place. Huh? Knock <laughs> it down. Next up, Robert Knox. <laughs> And they'll never find me. <laughs> Can I close this? How do I close it? Usually these street access things have like a button somewhere. This guy too. You've been a problem for too long, buddy. I fucking love this game. I fucking love it. It's just stupid, isn't it? Oh. That was a good shovel. Wait, where we dumping you in, mate? Give me a bit. <sighs> Almost there, buddy. I can't believe she was standing on a plastic sheet as well. I can't dump you there. I think I'm gonna be you. I'm you now. <laughs> How does that count as body hidden? Like, surely I can get down there, right? <laughs> I feel bad he's dead now. Hello, Shaga. It's me. You just saw me. <laughs> uh, Alright, where's my next target? All the way up there. Okay. Alright. As funny as that was, right? We're gonna restart the mission. And now we're gonna do... The F1 kill. Because <sighs> Sierra is the driver, right?
All right, here we go. Hi, bud. We go vroom vroom. We go vroom vroom. All right, let's go. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. If I was a... That's locked. Ah, there's an event map. Okay. Driver's lounge, VIP area. Shut the fuck up. I'm busy. Maybe try shooting her in broad daylight. I don't have a gun. I've lit... It's actually crazy that they've sent me here unarmed. If you could show me the invite, please. Right, yeah, about that. Okay, let's think, let's think, let's think, let's think. So I can see that guy there does have VIP access. Is that VIP access? No. Parking. Uh, stands VIP. God, I love his color code on the floor. Gotta go fast. Shit. Anything around here? Anything I can pick up? Hey guys, you got any stuff I can pick up? <laughs> so much trash on the floor you guys who does this who does this who drops the shit on the floor you bet you guys better not drop your shit on the floor put it in a bed hate that shit every weekend in cardiff people just drop their shit all over the floor i need something i can throw Can I buy something? Oh, that was fucking slick. <laughs> that was slick. That guy's gonna be like, where the fuck's my knife? Okay, here we go, right. Now, I know what you're thinking, boys. Oh my god, Kaif is about to stab a guy in broad daylight? Check it out. Remember, folks, that endurance bracelet is all about getting your car to cover as many miles as possible, no matter how burned out or beat up it may be. All right. Fucking got him. In you go. All right, that was good. All right. Event area key, the gun. Smart as fuck. Right, I'm part of the event crew. N huh, right. What? Go fast, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Don't forget the secret of endurance racing is to keep that clock going until Where would the pit crews be? Oh baby. Huh. I can't was trespassing? We're in, boys. We're in. Now we need a team costume. <laughs> 
Somebody's bound to hear it, right? Fuck. Maybe not. Thing. John. I saw this guy and he's not supposed to be there. Okay, thanks. Well, I'll deal with this. Huh. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Think, 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 think. Shh, go to sleep. Go to sleep. All right, perfect. How I took, how I pulled that one off, I'll never know, but it is what it is. Now get in the box. Problem solved. Think, 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 think. Oh, my Moses Lee is just flying out there. Look at those lap times. I guess he's out to show Matthias Schuster who's number one. Can I get away with this? Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> think, 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 think. I need to make some noise. The race is almost over. Uh, there's gotta be something. I just wanna be part of the race, man. <laughs> Okay. What the hell's going on here? Don't you fucking move! Don't you fucking move! Don't you move! I need help! <laughs> okay. Ah. Oh. No, 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 no. Just found a body. Going in for a closer look. Don't forget, this race is all about getting some miles on the system. It's as much about the car's <laughs> Oh my god, what the fuck is- What am I doing? <laughs> Alright, I'm in. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm here. I'm here. Let me join the race. You, you're the junior slip wrench who got injured yesterday, right? Yeah. I suppose I am. Great, this is your lucky day. Do well and there's a bonus in it, got it? Got, got it. it. Alright everyone, look alive and get to your stations. Sierra may come in for a last minute pit stop, and I need you ready and able. You Woo! get into position. Grab your preferred tool and be prepared. Today's your day to shine. Let's do this. Oh, wait. Oh, this is not driving. Where's my position? Hang on. I think this is me. No, I, I don't fucking know. Here we go. Hi, buddy. Grab my favorite tool. Uh. Aha! Uh. Pneumatic wrench. Pneumatic wrench. Pneumatic wrench. Don't think a normal wrench is gonna cut you. Yeah? Fuck. 
Yo, where'd you guys keep the pneumatic wrench? With the wrench. There's gonna be something around here, gotta be something. Normal wrench. Hey, spanner monkey. I just need to talk to you. Who does this guy think he Hey, I'm busy a sec. Run out of time. You're fucking done searching a lot. Have you played a dead and night? Yes, I have, yeah. Target down. Next up, Robert Knox. What the hell just happened? Sierra. Well then. Huh. What's up, man? <laughs> Everyone's, Everyone's gonna be okay, boy. Alright. Let's see if I can get him in the bin. Boys, can anyone tell me, is it possible, right, for us to um, be one of the drivers? Look at his underwear. Okay. Sorry. Go to sleep. Oh, I didn't mean to do that! I just killed a guy! <laughs> I did it again! No! <laughs> there we go. Ah! <laughs> oh. Whoops. To be, I was like, oh yeah, cue the knockout, walk over to the kitchen staff and break his neck. <laughs> Can't drive the cars, no, but there's a ton of track related kills. Okay. Well, that was a good one. I like that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's lost me. Sliding a little in the turn here, guys. Look at these tires, we're not gonna cut it. There we go. I <laughs> hate when I accidentally snap someone's neck, yeah. <laughs> this fucking camera in. keeps moving. Could 
Could you just shoot them while they're driving? Probably. The only issue is that I don't have a gun. Sick. Next up, Robert Knox. What the hell just happened? Sierra. Oh, hi, guys. That's a whoopsie. <laughs> Shh, go to sleep. <laughs> All the way to fall over. No, don't hit the alarm. Don't hit the alarm. Don't hit the alarm. Fuck. Uh. Oh, there's no way. Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> hang the fuck on. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do. We all know what I'm gonna do. Actually throwing. I can't help myself, dude. There's something about throwing objects which is so funny. I say that. you two, you just group up, right? Alright, well, that was fucking grim. Solved the problem of these guys spot me though, didn't they? I'll take that. Just can't resist. I can't resist. In you go. There we go. Can't wait to see a score. I know, right? Here we go. No one come to investigate the loud noise? Ah, it is always loud noises here. Uh-oh, body found. <laughs> Can we skip this? Nope. Ah. Uh, God, I love it. Here's your new wheel. Good luck. Target down. Next up, Robert Knox. Guys, I can't do eventually kill the whole map. Yeah. Oh, dude, I want his outfit. I need you to stand up. Let's go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Got some info on the perk. Hey, what's up, everybody? Yo, I'm a mechanic, so I get VIP, right? Oh wait, I was in VIP. What's up, bitches? Okay, so he's watching from the stands, I think, maybe? Make sure you have a great view of the celebrations from the stands. Alright, what we got? What we got? Uh, This is Intel. What am I doing? I have no idea what the fuck that is. Let's do it. We're gonna have to go into parking, I think. Where'd I go? Shocker. Shocker. <laughs> I can't believe he's actually lost me. Tee hee. That's 
one of the Kronstadt mechanics, but he's away from the pit. I wonder what he's up to. And now a short message from our sponsors, Guardian Tires. Huh. Because you're so that's what I could, probably could have got one of their outfits. Let's go to parking. Smart stealth game NPC. I love the Hitman uh, NPCs. Kind of look like the Tour de France in there. What with all the hmm. syringes and I... Wait. I'm here now. Ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Yeah, you won't be seeing her, my man. I think I'm going the right way. Feels like I'm going the right way. Oh, of course. Yeah, I remember now. I remember where we are. There he is. How well do I blend in? That is Ted Mendez, one of the country's most influential military-grade money men. This must be connected to Kronstadt. Apparently, I blend in really well. Phil, it's Ted here. Just Wait. returning your call Contact. before heading over to the expo building to meet Knox what with a new combat android. There it is. No, not yet. I'm letting him stew. I'm starving. Genius, and you know what they like. Could be lacking in the respect for other people. Last time I tried to have a meeting with him, he had been sitting in a room for anyone want cold KFC? We all love cold KFC, right? Alright, I'll call you after the presentation. Speak then. Oh. Oh, it's cold. It's not good. Oh, no good. After disguises him? Chicken's chicken, yeah. I don't really fancy uh, heating up cold chicken either. Anyway. I want to turn this on. Oh, there we go. Oh! Oh! That was so fucking grim. I mean, I expected it, but like, damn, dude. Chunky salsa. <laughs> oh, I got my chicken. Ah, I dropped my chicken again. No, I'm not. Mr. Mendez, good to see you, sir. The demonstration is scheduled to take place on the upper floors. Please feel free to use the stairs right over there. Yeah, I'm gonna need directions. Ow. Excuse me. Can you tell me where to go, please? It's just up these stairs. Okay. That didn't help. Sorry. Hey, how are you? How are you, sir? Hi. Love you guys. I can't believe like they just see me and go, "Yeah, it looks like him." First time on the stream. What's up, Jake? Hope you enjoy, man. Mr. Mendez, right this way, sir. Oh, these guys are so nice. Oh, hello, HR. Yes, it's Finn Wheeler down at the Bayside Center. 
Uh, listen, I realize this may sound trivial, but the Fountain View soda dispenser has been on the fritz since we moved in. I can't work without my energy drinks, and I have been forced to bring my own. Well, y yes, that's right, they fixed it today, but... And here's the problem, you see. Mr. Knox and his entourage of gun-wielding bodyguards managed to empty the machine in one hour. I was thrilled to receive the email telling me the machines were back in order, but to come in and discover how Knox and his First world problems have been indeed. seemingly bathing in Fountain View all morning. <laughs> well, let me tell you, the disappointment is substantial. Not a matter for HR. Uh, how so? I, well, I, 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 I don't think it's wise of me to take it up with Mr. Knox himself. No, I... Oh, I, I see. Well, uh, uh, yes, yes, well, uh, thank you. Uh, Why did he just save? Do you reckon I can make this guy go like, just full pissed off, so, disgruntled employee? On the corporate grapevine. Mr. Mendes. Oh. Hi guys, so what's going on here? Robert, it's Derek. Mr. Mendez is here already. He's eager to get on with the demo. You should come by as soon as possible. You got intel. You sure? You have to get a picture Knox, by the way. What does that mean? Hi, buddy. Ah, Ted, good to finally see you. Guess traffic was rough. Ah, never mind. Let me show you everything. I'm gonna say something provocative now, Ted. War is going out of fashion. It's dirty. It's just plain bad PR. Nobody wants to exchange their children and loved ones for flags and medals anymore. The glory is gone, Ted. But luckily, Kronstadt has a solution for that. Imagine this. Android infiltrators operating in the field, disguised and fully embedded, ready to strike at a moment's notice. Indestructible robotic operators who can infiltrate the deepest sanctuary of any adversary, striking an unseen fatal blow, a surgical tool. Oh. For a Hello blood there. world, imagine an army of them, fully equipped android medics, Seeking out wounded servicemen and injured civilians, bringing them to safety, or patching them up then and there. Android pilots delivering payloads deep inside enemy territory with uncanny precision and minimal collapse. Uh. damage. All right, Mendez, it's very straightforward. Let me show you. I just pick any of the pictures on the desk. Then I use the scanner to upload the biometric data, and Palace will do the rest. Acquired. WB. Obviously, the final system won't rely on you manually feeding it biometric data. This is still a prototype. This is a pivotal moment in modern conflict solution, Ted. Palace is entirely foolproof. All you need is to pick a photo from the table and scan it just like I showed you. It's perfectly safe. Go ahead. Uh How am I going to get Ready, it to Mendes? shoot Take him? Any image on the table and scan it to activate Palace. Hold on, buddy. I'm investigating. What's the hold up, Mendez? Just I'm scan looking. one of the pictures. Hey there. Oh. This is gonna be the weirdest fucking thing ever, but what if? Sorry, I thought you were someone else. <laughs> Does that not work? Just scan one of the images. Mendez, 
But you stay there a sec. I need a picture of him. That's what that person in the chat said. Where do I get a fucking picture of Robert Knox? Oh. oh. Ready, Pick any image Chicken's way better though. We did save a few minutes back. That was a good point, actually. What's the hold up, Mendez? Just scan one of the pictures. Dude, KFC with beans is amazing. Ow. <laughs> um. Just scan one of these. This is the same. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was in a rush today, boys. I didn't get to eat before stream. <clears throat> Try again. Uh, yes, yes, well, uh, thank you. Uh. Uh. Right then. The small amount of attention you're giving game details is making me nervous. Don't worry about it. I'm a legend. Alright, before we go in then. I'm hearing rumors on the corporate grapevine. Apparently, Knox wants to do a large scale field test of Palace in a few months. Huh. Well, that sounds like one of those entirely unfounded rumors that gets spread around down at the local bar after. From Getucky, how is UK KFC? It's all right. Well, Lyle from outsourcing told me there'd been a request to reach out to Jing Po. The reply back had been positive. Right. I'm gonna ignore those guys. I'm gonna see if I can find a picture of our boy. Do you reckon I can just flat out shoot him through there? Okay, McInnes, let's run this test. You're sure you fixed all outstanding issues with the micro actuator? Yeah, boss, I'm sure. Checked an hour ago. All lights are green. Wait. This fella will make your special place all tingly. But, 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 <sighs> there's something we should talk about. Maybe these, uh... There's a hole, right? If I put a picture on the hole, it should target it, right? So, well, a man died. Yes, that was quite unfortunate. I believe legal has resolved the matter with life. Well, we know. It's not going to work, though, is it? Like the biometric scanners I'm going to try it. If you really want Ted Mendez, right? I wasn't told you were here, but I'm glad to see you. Let's go. Importantly, it feels like the biometric scanners aren't 100%. <laughs> it's not letting me do it. It's such a fucking good idea, though. The console can't fail. It's not exactly tamper proof. So fix it. Look, McKinnis, I'm counting on you here. I'm literally putting my. They just forgot I was there. With this demo. We need to pull this off. I know you don't like it, but I'm the boss and I like it. Big sales is what I do. Make it work. I'll see what I can do. Good man. It's not a printer on the table with the pictures. No. Listen, you're gonna end up getting hurt. Mr. Mendez. Like Hi, buddy. Okay, let's have a little. Let's have a little kawinky thing, you know?
Think, 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 think. The ladder is driving you nuts with hunger? No, no, that wasn't it. I was thinking about what might collecting pictures of celebrity <laughs> entrepreneurs now, 47. Hmm. What are you thinking? What well, um What am I thinking? Ah, Ted, you finally see Hi, you. buddy. This traffic was rough. Ah, never mind. Let me show you everything. That's fucked. I'm going to say something Hi. provocative now, Ted. War is going out of fashion. It's dirty. It's just plain bad PR. Nobody wants to exchange their children and loved ones for flags and medals anymore. The glory is gone, Ted. But luckily, Kronstadt has a solution for that. I feel like, right? This. Android if you replace humans with robots in war, disguised and fully embedded, political leaders are going to be a lot those. more bloodthirsty for war. Robotic operators who can infiltrate the deepest all wars bad. But like, if they're like, oh, you know, if we send robots in, then you know, nobody dies. They'd probably be more willing to do it. I know, maybe I'm. Them to or them up maybe I'm just dumb. Android pilots we should make the leaders go 1v1 in a boxing match, yeah. Enemy territory with uncanny precision and minimal collateral damage. All right, Mendez. Depends how expensive the robots are. Let me show you. Mate, the U.S. military loves spending money. <laughs> Trust. The scanner to upload the biometric data, and Palace will do the rest. Target acquired. WB. She. Obviously, the final system won't rely on you manually feeding it biometric data. This is still a prototype. This is a pivotal moment in modern conflict solution, Ted. Palace Russia and Ukraine already have drones. This is already a thing. Yeah, but those drones are killing people. <laughs> and scan it just like I showed you. I don't know. I don't even. I don't know what I'm talking about. Go ahead. Make my day. Sorry, bud. Oh. Both targets down. Well done, for we have a Head for an exit, and we'll speak right, again soon. You guys not questioning what the fuck just happened? I just scanned a picture of Robert Knox. Uh oh, they're a bit sus now. You scanned the wrong side and all. I know. Accidents happen, bro. I flat out was like, "Here is a picture of Robert Knox from my pocket. Here you go, Mr. Robot." <laughs> Shit. Ooh, an apricot, you say? Looking good, man. Thanks, man. Oh, I want to throw this apricot so bad. I want to throw the apricot so bad. Boys, you have no idea. What you doing here, guys? What's this android arm here for? Quite a few android arms. I'm inspecting the facility, yeah? As part of my inspections, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to test the capabilities of your robot, your robot arm. Okay, <laughs> let's see how good the robot arm is. Oh no, I can't do it! I can't do it! I can't do it! All my time to you. Change the world, Dolores. I know Knox thinks Palace is the big thing, but he's wrong. Nobody will care about that abomination once they see your splendor, Nixon. Derek McInnes, chief android engineer at Kronstadt, apparently keeps a series of personal journals. In this one, he goes into some detail about his work on Palace. That keeps digressing into another project where he's nicknamed Dolores. Wait, this is a Westworld reference, right? Am I crazy? Oh, 
What's this about the flamingo? You drag the flamingo unconscious body over there and kill all who stops you. True. I bet he jazzed on that robot. Yeah, yeah, he, bet. he definitely uh, jazzed. <laughs> Apparently he's trying to create a companion robot, but Nox wants nothing to do with it. Well, Nox is a fucking idiot, right? Because if this guy made a robot companion, you would make a lot more money than war. The same amount as war. <laughs> Just do both. McKinnis seems overly affectionate towards his creation and resents Nox for his lack of interest. What is Aaron is back? Nox doesn't understand. He sees you as an object, a tool to satisfy some primal physical urge. He's a savage. I'm creating life here, Dolores. Your life. I think people don't like him. <laughs> <laughs> Other people's lives. A man like Knox has no idea what it's like to move through the world unnoticed, unloved. A man like Knox who surrounds himself with sycophants and yes men and people who will go to any lengths to impress him in order to get access to his riches. What does he truly know about the human condition? Maybe he'd like some fruit. Oh my god, you're so right. As felt by millions of people, young as well as. Huh? <laughs> okay, that's not what I thought would happen. Yeah, I don't think anyone's coming in here anytime soon. Nice, now we got a new robot arm. Why is this one greasy? Oh, he definitely jerks himself off with that robot arm, 100%. What the hell's up there? What the fuck? Oh. No, my robot arm! My jizzy robot arm! How do I... There we go. What am I trespassing on right now? I got an idea. I will become him. How do I become you? Are you too unique? Huh. go problem solved there you go have a lay down there you go there you go buddy do you think they care that i'm holding a wrench nah see gamers look up oh, i want to find out what this place is all about I know I'm supposed to be escaping, but I absolutely love looking around the place. Who the fuck are you? He seems important. Science wrench? Yeah, I am holding a science wrench. Eh... So what are you guys doing here, huh? Science 
Scientists coming through. Uh, this type looks to match a satellite dish, a similar item. Uh huh. Man, there's a lot of scissors around here. Why do I want to play around with a satellite dish? Also, where do these wires go? Ah, there's the there's the satellite dish. I wonder what that did. I feel like that was one of the ways to kill. Anyway, scientists coming through. People are fucking the stands like, what the fuck is that scientist doing? Ruin their Wi-Fi so they can't watch the special videos, yeah. Yeah, I assume that is literally like... One of the kills for the, the daughter. What's up, bro? I'm lost. Go to the front of the dish? Okay. I'm lost again. <laughs> what exactly am I doing? Is chat balked? Yeah, the, uh, the restream chat keeps dying. Never mind. Yep. Hi. Um. Oh! Oh fuck, I didn't think I was doing that. I am so sorry. Ah, shit. Oh, you need to go to sleep. You need to go to sleep as well. Dude, I almost shotgunned you. Holy fuck, that guy got fucked up. Oh, shit, man. Oh, dear. I can't even scissors do that. That's kind of fucked, isn't it? Oh, it's one of the escapes. Hey, anyone got a key for the, uh, the helipad? Did you guys have a key for the helipad? Someone's bound to have it. Fuck your evidence. Oh, this place is lovely, isn't it? Look at this. Oh shit, I thought that was a door. That's not. Hi guys, anyone got a key for a helicopter? What is that? <laughs> rat poison, of course. There's gotta be rat poison on every level, you know? How do I get... What if? Guys, can you shoot locks? There we have it. So good. So good at this game. Woohoo! Ah. 
It's a secret exit if you go to the helicopter in the flamingo costume. Hmm. The thing is, I think I'd know if one of my co-workers was bald. I know, right? Goes into the bathroom we're here, comes out without any. How do we do on that mission then? One star! Let's go! Woo! I'm thinking, right? I kind of want to do that level again. That was really fun. Okay, so Lone Star Sat. Come on, bro. Bruh. Bruh. Come on, we're going to gamer mode. We're going to gamer mode. Let's do this. Hello. <laughs> skip, 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 skip. Killer with Wi Fi? Yeah, let's try it. Oh, there's a cutscene to watch. Berlin. Shanghai. What the fuck is this? Montreal. Bleeding operatives. Panic is spreading, and now we are axing our own. Knox was a traitor. He would have caused incalculable damage. And he won't be the last. This is exactly what the enemy wants. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptom. I'm sorry, right? But and I have if there are people the for the job. in some right. like triangle floating base, the they're bad guys. Eric Soders warned you about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I'm to the escape route assassin. There was nobody there, bro. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. <laughs> you ought to know. Load stream, Kyle staring at camera. Speaks the enemy's <laughs> language. We need them. And once we don't, <laughs> we'll cross that bridge. Did um, did Hitman that Three bring back like the fully we need to know who animated cutscenes? I was getting. Yes. Okay. His name is Lucas Gray, the late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Cobb no. was ground zero. First of our operatives to die. You got three yeses and no one, I think so. One of his staff, someone with military training. Can you resist the meme intrusive urges for an entire level? No. Yeah, grasping at straws. Gray is a mercenary. A veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. Chechnya, Sierra Leone, the list goes on. But before 89, nothing. No records of any kind. You said gamer mode, that is true. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the current oh, do you guys like my poster, by the way? <laughs> I'll show you in a sec. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. <clears throat> if you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, I couldn't give two shits where he came from. Hell yeah. I only want to know one thing. How does he know about us? And where does he piss from? Is our display duck poster? No. This hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. I'll show you in a sec. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. Ah. Like it or not, 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Just get me inside. Rico. I need to go. Fuck, there's a handprint on the wall. Right. Yeah, let me show you the poster. It's a duck, and it says, pathetic. <laughs> and we've also got, um,. Zelda on the wall. I've got more posters arriving. 
but soon, you know? Looks fantastic. I got food in my teeth. Sorry, boys. That's not Zelda, that's Link. It's a Zelda poster that has Link on it. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Grey. Bastard. Um, yeah, let's replay the mission. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. How do I go back? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This fucking restream chat is pissing me right off. Let's do the finish line again. I really want to do it. Next mission is also pretty good. We'll get it. Don't worry. Okay, I want a lock pick. Um, we're not doing coins. Coins are just too strong. We're, we're not doing coins. Ah. Uh, Yeah, we'll fuck it. We'll bring a, we'll bring the pale duck. That replay replays the mission. I wasn't sure. Well, I, w I knew it replayed the mission. I wasn't sure if it would bring me back to this screen where I can add stuff. I thought it might just go straight back into it. Smuggled item. I know how to get to the car park. Oh, the standstill. I know what that is too. Okay. Ooh. Nice. Wait. I'm gonna smuggle in another pistol. Here we go again. Agency pickup means you can bring bigger items. Okay. What do we think of the setup though, boys? We liking it? I'm liking it. The, the screen's uh... I got, like, screens going up, so I have to look up to read you guys. <laughs> it's nice. Nice. I like being able to, like, stand up and just stretch my legs a bit. Welcome bring in a briefcase lets you bring big items. Ah. The innovation race has to look up, like, real life. So true. So true. How many screens? It's just three. I say just three. It's two for the streaming PC, one for the gaming PC. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car. Her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby expo building where Kronstadt... How much new money cost? Uh, it was only the desk that cost me money. The Kronstadt which was... Has seen fierce 150 pounds? No, it wasn't that expensive. Moses Lee, CEO of I have four for my PC. Don't blame you. Sierra Knox will need to risk it all if she wants to win for the third year in a row. She gonna risk it all. Can I skip this? Yeah. What the fuck am I doing? Okay. Think. Oh shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's an issue. Mm. Of course, bringing a gun would be an issue, wouldn't it? <laughs> is this an alternate way in? Oh, dude, this is going to take me to the Bayside. Nah, no, I'm not going to take that guy's money. <laughs> hey, what the fuck? I got a job to do, unfortunately. Need this crowbar. Don't know what for, but it will come in handy. Was that 500? What? I was just walking into a wall. Hmm. Just 500. What are you talking about? I'm here now, ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Mm -hmm. Let's 
I'm gonna grab that key. Oh, maybe I should have listened to that, eh? I consider this map the best for a good reason, with all the ways to move around on a map utilizing the entirety of itself to the fullest extent. I pick up the documents from my van, but um, I had to knock out a guy and steal his flamingo outfit. Ah, maybe I should have listened to that. <laughs> Whoops. Geezy stuff, lad. Right, we'll do, uh, we'll take the flamingo outfit. Hey, bud. Hey, yo, did you find some keys over there? Oh, man, you're a real lifesaver. I am a real lifesaver. And I'm a life ender. What the fuck, you going this way this time? Fuck! You little dipshit. Okay, we'll follow him through. <clears throat> I know where to subdue him. Must have fallen down, man. What the hell? No way. No way. No way, man. The documents are gone. How are they gone? Why is it there? There's a lot of matches at once. Yeah, it's, it's fucking up today, man. Goody's gonna kill me. Get on the fucking floor, you little bitch! Right. Step one. We've got the flamingo. Step two. Dump the body. Entering its final lap, 47. Step four. I'm not sure. Okay, we go back up, right? Back to the stands, get our concealed gun. Was it this way? No, it was that way. No, this is not the way. To be fair, I'm a fucking employee, let me in. Never mind. So I subdued him there. I guess I came from here. God, I am so bad with the directions in this place. Wait, I don't think this is the way I came from. Wait, what? Why was I locked? Fuck! That's fine. No, that's not fine. Let's just restart. We just start. I realize if you take the flamingo outfit, it's going to end the race quicker, isn't it? Yeah. Pretty sure. It is nice that uh, when you do objectives like that, it does like speed things along to in order for you to do the mission Looking sort of like today, smooth okay we get into the event what's going on here by the way Hey, what's the chance I can just go in? Huh. 
All right. I don't know. This is my first gig. Never been to any of these races before, but it sure is loud. I heard something. That's it. I'm just in. Dude, this map is so fucking big. It's unreal. Actually insane. Don't worry about if anything goes awry, you'll see him down awry. I'm not gonna lie, I actually thought that word was Ori. Robert Knox has a race car on display in the expo building. The show staff is under strict instructions to summon him at any sign of malfunction. Apparently, Knox trusts no one to fix his car but him. Hmm. Perhaps it's time to poke around under the hood, 47. They do say one should never mess with another man's wheels. Okay. Okay, in order to sabotage this, I'm going to need A, a screwdriver, B, to be an employee. <laughs> you guys got a screwdriver anywhere around here, mate? You got a screwdriver for me, lad? Alright, we're in. Now we gotta be real quiet. <laughs> the timing on that. What the fuck? Hey, let's go. All right, boys. Hacker voice. I'm in. You guys got a screwdriver? Screwdriver around you anyway, boys? Oh, a hammer. That'll come in handy. There we go. Fucking screwdriver. Any access cards around here? That'd be lovely. <laughs> using state of the art surgery robots. is the first production unit and is identical to the one Sierra Knox has been racing these past 2 days, but being the very first one is a bit special. Hmm. Weird. How the fuck How am I getting away with this shit? God damn! God damn! What the fuck? Right through. Just this once. Just this once. Go. What are you doing, Tyke? Oi! Stop scratching the carpet. Come here. Tyke, come here, mate. Let's say out a chat. Oh, I'm gonna get Tyke a few boys. Go lay down anyway, bud. There's so much stuff about the place in here, because, uh, Obviously, I was redoing the setup, so we couldn't find a way in. But, uh... Like, do you want to jump on the sofa or something? Do you want to lay on the sofa? Go on, go to bed. Sniff. <sighs> go on, jump on the sofa. I'll get the screen out of the way, eh? Never mind. Whoa, kitchen PC's not available, bro. Ah, uh, you'll settle down soon. 
Right, so now I'm an engineer. And a screwdriver. Nice. Blending in. Blending in. So I can sabotage the engine. Right. <laughs> Interesting. Don't know why that's a thing. I dare say this should get Nox's undivided attention. I haven't considered how I'm gonna kill him. Hey buddy, try to start the car, will you? Oh, I see. Well, that doesn't sound good. Better call Knox. I see, that's why I can get in there. Mr. Knox? Yeah, it's Smith from down at the expo. Listen to Everyone deserves a little break, even Agent 47. <laughs> odd noises. Uh, can you come? Great. All right. Yeah, yeah, I'll be here. Fuck. Oh, is that it? If I want an Octane Booster, where would I find Octane Booster, eh? I swear to God, if someone's been tampering with the car, heads will roll. I need you to get in the car. Don't touch anything until I tell you. Huh. Let's just see how this one plays out. Try the engine, Smith. All right, try it now. This should work. Ah, here we are. Just a loose wire back there. Just reattach it. Good. Hit it, Smith. Right. Damn it. That's it. Smith, if you see anyone, and I mean anyone, Messing with the car, you call me. You hear me? That's gonna stop me from doing it again. Let's get the octane booster. <laughs> if I had to guess every single garage since they're using it to cheat, that is actually a good point. Hello, it's me. I'm, I'm part of the display. Okay, we all recognize that voice, right? Have you come here to dismantle me? Hacker voice, I'm in. Right, let's look for... So I'm thinking the Octane Boost is probably going to be at the racetrack, isn't it? Maybe we can find... I don't know, actually. I need to conceal my gun somewhere. Hmm. Humpstedib indeed. He gets down here so quickly. I know, I was fast as fuck, wasn't it? Think. Think. I'm here now, ready to meet up with Sierra Knox over at the hotel. Yeah, I'll be right back. Oh, he's uh, he's having a little sleep on the floor. Okay, we head back up. I'm in, boys. I'm fucking in. Okay, step two. Yeah, you stupid fuck. That's right. 
Now I'm you. I shit you not, boys. The, uh, the chat has died. I literally, like, I can see you guys talking when I individually go to my streams. But in terms of the mixed chat, it's fucking dead. Bruh. Right, so now we're security. We're all dead. We all die. I, it's so sad. Oh, now it's working again. Fucking great. You received 100 messages today with restream chat. Oh. Wait, that's not right. <laughs> that's not even right. That's wrong. Oh, boy. Don't try that at home, people. Sierra's ducking in behind me as a... Hi, mate. Just Ooh, let's avoid that guy. Hi, Ty. What are you doing underneath me? Okay. I'm gonna get away with this. The race is entering its final lap, forty-seven. Shh. No, Ty. You can't sleep underneath my legs. <laughs> High octane fuel. I remember it being somewhere around here. There it is, you dirty little cheetahs. Why can't he? Because there's all wires down there. Boom. Okay, now we go back to my previous outfit. Where was that again? Up here. Doesn't the race recommence after a little bit? Oh shit, does it? We're all back in me suit. The race is over. Sierra will be coming off the track any time now. You know what? It is what it is. No, it doesn't. Oh. Don't worry about it, boys. Don't worry about it. Uh, yeah. Thanks. Doctor gave me some sort of vitamin hydration. Is it a bad time to tell you there was a garage with the octane less than 30 feet from your car? <laughs> it is what it is. I'm super lost already. Okay, all right, he's sleeping under me. Fair enough. That is where he chooses to be now. He's a good boy. Yes, you are. God, I love this robot arm. Hi, guys. Just come back off my break. I'm going to go work on his car now. Right in. Kronstadt has the best cars. Keep up the good work. Hey, buddy, try to start the car, will you? Well, that doesn't sound good. Better call Knox. Oh, no. Salutations, my Mr. friends. Hey. Uh, I'm sorry, sir. You can't just leave that here. Mr. Knox? Yeah, it's Smith from down at the expo. Listen, the Mark III's making some, well, just odd noises. Uh, can you come? Great. All right. Yeah, yeah, I'll be here. That didn't look good. I think the guy's going to get his, fl uh, like his face blown off. Hey, press guy, come take pictures of this, mate. It's going to be quite explosive, if I don't say so myself. 
Where's our man? Where's our special man? Oh, fucking hell, he runs you. Yes, sir. Don't mind if I do. All right, try it now. This should work. Man, how did that wire come loose again? Ah, <laughs> here we are. Just a loose wire back there. Man, that's crazy. The wire came out again. I wonder why that happened twice, huh? Well, that's one way of doing it. Fucking goddamn. Austin, what is that stuff anyway? I think some of the teams are using it to increase car speed. Heard a few Kronstadt mechanics talking about it the other day. Something about Knox not wanting to use it because she wants to win on her own. Yo, where the fuck am I now? Where the fuck am I? Is this catering? Or is this like some after party? Thank you very much. My pleasure. I must say, it was a joy to watch you crush the opposition. No, no. Very impressive. Anyway, oh, it's like the racers lounge. Uh-oh. Oh, he just fell over, man. Okay, okay. Who am I compromised to? <laughs> I have no idea. I didn't see him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where are you at? I'm still only compromised to the one. So I just... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. So what the fuck is this place? I can't believe there's, there's so much to this map, man. <clears throat> Whoa, I had the key for that. Yeah, I'm gonna take some rat poison. Okay, we're all good. You really just got away with that? You fucking right I did. Go somewhere safe. Let the pros do their thing. We are on top of this. <laughs> okay, next up. Good day to you, sir. Oh my gosh, the winner's podium. Did she win? <laughs> I 
I ain't touching the fucking trophy. Wi-Fi kill? I thought the Wi-Fi kill was the, uh... The guy you disguised as one? Oh. Wee! I fucking won, lads! Wee! Wee! I'm the winner, baby! <laughs> Uh Wait, was I just on that camera? <laughs> right. Maybe I should go to the stage. Hey! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I'm the best driver you've ever seen, baby! Hey, why are you walking away? <laughs> Poison mode! Poison my own trophy on live TV, baby. Oh, yeah. I'm the best. <laughs> All right. So, so I won. Um, was there like other ways they can die? Area was compromised. Okay. I don't know what this one is. Does she ever approach the stage? Oh yeah, looking at that, I'm gonna go ahead and say no. Oh, forgot my arm. If she wins. Oh. Oh, I assume there's a way that you can make her win then. Need to rig it so she wins. Damn. Moses Lee wins if there's no interference. Are you saying these guys were planning to rig it? Or is that me just rigging it something I can do? Sorry. 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 I'm telling you, Miss Knox is going to be pissed. I did the pre-race checkup on her and... Well, let's just say she's got a bad case of There's intermittent a delay, explosive folks, disorder. Sure we can expect the well, Dr. Innovation Sorry, race winners on the podium First, he almost loses seconds. a patient to a seemingly harmless case of dehydration. Now he has to deal with this guy suffering from urinary retention. <laughs> Not his day. Let's just hope he doesn't somehow screw up the revitalization procedure on Miss Knox. I know it's just a simple injection, but given his track record these past few days... Well... At least we know who's buying us beer tonight. So, it seems Sierra Knox has jumped on the revitalization bandwagon and is scheduled the for fuck an is that? of some sort. The doctor who is supposed to help her with the procedure is preoccupied with a patient who is unable to urinate. Curious situation, 47. Maybe you can speed things up.
What? <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Okay. I'm told it'll be a few minutes more before the winning team takes the podium, but it should be delayed. More information will follow. That's the CEO of Kowloon. Can I be in here? So did Oh, hello there. Just take a seat. We're we're very busy right now. So did Dr. Sorensen manage to get Sierra Knox's phone number? I heard him arguing with that Kronstadt lawyer earlier. No, he didn't have any Any race event profession. Like what? Where's this go? Sorry. No offense, but please get out of my face. Sorry, bud. go there we go all right come with me buddy i'm not i'm not a race winner anymore boys i'm part of the crew there you go have a lovely day this is my robot arm it's gotta come with me bro is just doing his job yeah but you know I want that job, so... You know. <laughs> Wait, I'm supposed to disguise myself as a medic. I don't think he... You... That is awkward. Well, at least I can sit down now. Anyway, how am I gonna get myself to be a medic? There's a slight delay, folks, but I'm sure we can expect the global innovation race winners on the podium in a few seconds. I look like I belong. I look like I belong. I mean, I don't look like I belong, but I'm in anyway. Ooh. I'm gonna have to ask you to get a move on now. I have Sierra Knox coming in next for a post-race IV vitamin. I don't want to keep her waiting. I'm doing my Is he supposed to say that to his patients? Oh, Mr. Duran, any luck yet? Maybe if you think about running water. Not really helping here, not it? How am I gonna make this man pee? Go, 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 fast, 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 fast. Shit. What do you think you're doing, you sick pervert? Okay, right. Right. Things have gone a little bit off track. Just a slight little bit off track. But that's fine. What do you mean, find a lethal syringe, by the way? What are you guys doing keeping lethal syringes about the place? Oh, well. Problema sol... Do. What am I doing? Right, and now we head back. He's also dealt with. <laughs> hello, hello, just doing my job. Oh, doctor. I'm so happy to see you. I'm guessing you're 
here to replace Dr. Sorensen. Yes, I just shaved my head. I'll prepare for her arrival. All right, what am I doing? I'm told it'll be a few minutes more. It's a lethal poison pill jar. Good thing I got a lockpick. Any strangers lethal if you put enough solution in it? Fair. <laughs> the doctor will see you now. Excellent work, 47. Sierra Knox should be on her way to the emergency area. Oh, that's fucking class. What's going on over there? Oh, right there in the locker, yeah. How even into an empty syringe would be lethal. Air in the veins is no joke. That's true. Yeah. That's very true. Paging Mr. Knox. Mrs. Knox. Paging Miss Knox. The doctor will see you now. Where's she at? There she is. Maybe I should hide this limb. Because, you know, uh, that robot arm's pretty out of place. The blood. It's normal for a doctor's area, you know? She's like, oh, what happened? Oh, yeah, the guy's vein just went nuts, you know? <sighs> Damn it, can I feel drip? I can just do it while it's in her, no? Yeah, fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> oh, boy. Bitch, we sitting down for? I'm ready. Maybe I gotta go talk to her. I'm told it'll be a few minutes more before the winning team takes the podium, but it shouldn't be long now. Hello, Miss Knox. Miss Knox. I'm ready for you. Let's do this. Come on in. Hey, don't mind that drawer being open. There was nothing in it. Huh? You know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. All right, Doc. Where do you want me? Miss Knox, come on in. Have a seat and relax. So, what's on the menu? Something that'll take care of this hideous pain in my neck, I hope. I promise. Once I'm done, you won't feel a thing. So what's in this thing anyway, Doc? Mostly floral extracts, mm. hemlock, belladonna, aconite. Hey, watch this. Come, come, come here. Fast and efficient. I like that. Okay. Wait, belladonna. Well, you're on camera. Isn't that poisonous? Yes. Should I be concerned? I'm not. <laughs> It'll be over soon. Hello. Ew. A squidgy. Oh, no problem, no problem. Are you injecting her with poison? No. Game looks good, though. Hi. Think you're coming on hey, a bit you know strong. What? I do feel refreshed. Uh, I just don't think so. My pleasure, Miss Knox. Back off, okay? Uh, so, dude, I... This guy. Oh, it's fine. Feel... No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I don't oh, feel again? well, doctor. Don't worry. You don't feel too good. It'll be over huh? soon. You don't feel too good. She doesn't feel too good now. Oh. oh. Both targets. Medic. Well done, 47. Somebody call an ambulance. <laughs> I was going to ask you if you wanted to play league, but you're busy. I'm not committing a crime. She just died. No, 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 no. I'm playing Hitman. Oi. You saw too much. <sighs> Tango is lost. Move. Find him. Over there. Shooters around here. Fan out. Watch your step. Stop. 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 St
I've heard enough. Hey! Hey, where you going? Oh, fucking flashbang. <laughs> oh boy, here he goes killing again. Damn it, it was me. <laughs> Just kidding, I knew it was me. Oh, hang on. Oh shit! Fucking scared the shit out of me, man. Where am I? Location check. Suspect not here. Hey, kill. Answer, please. It's confirmed. We have a murderer here. All right, find out, guys. Help! Let's find this fucking murderer. Where is he? <laughs> Everyone, we gotta find. Oh God! How did that blood get there? Oh no! <laughs> no idea. It's me. We're cool here. Let me know if you find anything. Here we go. Problem solved. Hello, it's me, kitchen staff. What are you guys looking at? Hello. Can I tempt you with a little snack? <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go. Come get your foods. Come have a snack, lad. Thanks a lot. No problem. Enjoy. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit! She was allergic to sushi, boys! Fuck! Who would have known? Damn! Oh, well, may as well. Hey, can you, uh, can you go away? You're gonna spot me the moment I stop doing what I'm doing. <laughs> now you notice, All right? <sighs> Must find Flamingo. Flamingo spotted. Ah. All right, boys. We found a flamingo. Uh oh. Nobody judge me. I'm just, I'm just being a great hitman, you know. Let's kind of know you can dress as a Florida man in one of these missions. Pass class. Does anyone know where I left the flamingo costume? Uh, you're dragging the. Why would you drag the body there? Oh, 
I mean, staff gonna do what staff gonna do. Don't let me get in your way. Am I trespassing if I go by you? I am not. Can I serve Dindins? Alright, back to the garage. I think that's probably where the costume is, right? I'm gonna check chat, you guys can tell me, just in case. In the garage, okay. Let's fucking go. Oh shit, yeah, I never subdued him. Speed this shit up. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Man, I wasn't careful if I was you. Your back can snap just like that. You know, it's my crime. Oop. Don't make me do this. Right. <laughs> Could you fucking stop noticing my crimes? <laughs> You'd be alive if you just didn't have eyes. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Pitting the town red, I see. It's not my fault, man. They keep noticing me doing fucked up things. Oh, come on! I'm going back to the event before someone else spots me. Wait, it's not the event. It's, uh... This way, I think. Hello, guys! Brilliant job you're doing, by the way. No dead bodies just around the corner. <laughs> Isn't there an elevator shaft you can climb down here? What the fuck? Ah, right, use the building. We tried not doing fucked up things. No. <laughs> right now, have you figured out how to use PlayStation Dreams? No, I keep asking you guys when you mention it, and then I don't read chat again. How do I do it? What body? Oh, is this the elevator shaft you're on about? That's definitely a place you can dump a body. Alright, I need to figure out... Where does this go? Nah. I need to figure out how to get upstairs. Oh, you can go on the ledge. There we go. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby. And I'm in. Wrong way. 
Rat poison, screwdrivers. Ooh, hello. Okay. We run the sink. Can anybody hear that? You can't... Come on, you can hear the sink. <sighs> oh, there we go. Right in. I don't know where that body is. Shit, I forgot that was in... Fuck! Did Omaru ever follow up on that? No. Tell me how to use... PlayStation Dreams. Okay, that's one down. Man, I'm good at this stealth. You had your cut. I know. I forgot I had it. That's the problem. Well, you know, it is what it is. Um, yeah. Almost there, lads. Almost there. That's it. Go to sleep. Um, now him around the corner is going to be a problem. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, not anymore. <laughs> right, you said there was a secret exit, right? If I go out here as the burb, yeah? All right, where's the plane? I say plane, helicopter. Oh my god. <laughs> There's no fucking way. <laughs> no way. Oh. Are you shitting me? <sighs> well then, I mean gamer mode's over. There was absolutely no reason for me to stand there while that went down. <laughs> oh, dude, I fucking love this game. This game's so good, man. It's so good. Where have we seen this? Berlin. Right, next mission. So the next one's Three Headed Serpent. Is that our secret lab? No, of course it. Good morning, 47. It's not that great. Contact has shared Trust the identity me. Of the Get yourself a standard office chair, they're way better. Mercenary and bodyguard by the name of Lucas Gray. 
His past is a black void, but our analysts are digging deep. Meanwhile, we've had a breakthrough of our own. Comparing the malicious attack patterns with global shipping and transportation routes, we've figured out how Mr. Gray and his paramilitaries move around the world undetected. Plane? They're using the distribution network of the Delgado Cartel, Colombia's biggest drug manufacturer. Clearly, Gray must have struck a deal with the Delgados. Consequently, if we can cripple the cartel, we can severely limit the malicious strike range. But to do so, we need to slay a three-headed serpent. Sociopathic cartel head Rico Delgado and his two closest lieutenants. Okay. VR guru Andrea Martinez and Sam There's also another one where you hold a fish from the aquarium and do something by the dolphin fountain. With equal parts, guts huh. and guile, Rico Delgado runs a thriving billion-dollar criminal empire. The world That's a cool cutscene. The brutal and volatile cartel head is hell-bent on becoming the number one drug lord in the world. To achieve this, Martinez, a childhood friend of Delgado's, has been buttering up state leaders and decision makers, paving the way for an expansion of the Delgado Logistics Network, while the brilliant but aloof and antisocial Franco has been hard at work developing a new type of super cocaine. So, <laughs> oh my God. three of Colombia's most infamous crime lords inhabiting a decidedly hostile environment. I will leave you to prepare. A. Anyone wants super cocaine? Oh, I can actually bring stuff here. All right, we're not taking the... The coin is fucking busted. So we're not going to take that. I'm going to take the remote duck. No, we'll take the normal duck. There's only one starting location, okay? Suit. Ooh, smart casual. I like it. I feel like I'm going to be really warm. Okay, I'll take a fish. Busted good or busted bad? Like, it's busted good because you can kill, you can kill so effectively with the coin, but it does make the missions a lot more trivial. Like it, it puts me in situations where I'm like, I would have struggled, and the moment I use the coin, I'm like, I can kill him easy. Welcome to Colombia, forty-seven. The remote village of Santa Fortuna awaits you deep inside the Colombian rainforest. An iron-fisted Delgado cartel rules over the village and its surroundings. Yeah? Security I want to ride the one of those Fortuna boats. And the closed-off cartel compound is extremely tight. Did Arms the chat freeze? It always freezes. Ready to enforce harsh punishments to those who do not. You end up being less creative sometimes because of it. Yeah, exactly. Rumors persist of hidden transportation cave systems. These motherfuckers will use coke too. <laughs> yeah. It is a rare occurrence. Kind of likes to make games harder for himself. No, I just. Uh, in the village at the when you play Hitman, you got to do it in the most creative way. I mean, you. Expect that all targets are protected by scrupulous killers armed with automatic weapons. Oh, fun. Rico Delgado. Habits his fortified mansion on the outskirts of the village. While Andrea Martinez can be found in her village office or around Santa Fortuna itself. And Jorge Franco is engaged in development of a new drug in his field laboratory. Happy hunting, 47. Thank you. Oh, I'm gonna pee. I got to pee. The, uh, this PC is closer to my bathroom now. Hoping you don't hear me pee. <laughs> Hello. <sighs> Why does it sound so weird? Does he have a, a UTI or something? We heard you pee and Kaifu with a little toot you loud. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You can hear me pee? Oh no. Damn. You frying chicken in there? You piss loud as fuck. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. 
Somebody would have clipped it because you're fuck. You're all fucking weird. Nah, I don't believe you. Whatever, we're carrying on. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> fucking weirdos. I'll tell Ebs. I'll fucking tell Ebs on you. Right, let's see. Let's have a little walk around. Are you dead, mate? Okay, bud. I'm just doing you a favor. Ground. Oh, there's no outfit for me to take. You know what? I don't know why I did that. I was like, oh man, I want to wear his fucking sombrero. Oh well. I don't know why I wanted to do that. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. I just can't stop killing. I can't stop killing. Oh, meeting Steve Power in a local bar in a tiny village like this. I mean, he's only the biggest celebrity tattoo artist in the world. Maybe he's here to see that Delgado guy we've been hearing about. Delgado. Sounds like he's got money to spare. Ooh, could be. So, P Power. Celebrity tattooist of Tattoo Torment. Don't say P Power. Come to Santa Fortuna. Don't say P Power. Presumably to work his magic on Rico Delgado, a known ink enthusiast. Sounds like an invitation to the mansion, 47. Are you feeling expressive? Yes. <sighs> Lucky guy. I wish I could afford one of his pieces. Ah, uh, his work isn't that impressive. Oh, oh, I'm not dressing up as them, okay. Doing? Just touch ups and cover ups of botched work on that reality TV show it is. On stuff that looks like crap probably isn't too hard, you know? Yeah, no. P Power is what Evs calls Kai when they're feeling kinky. No. If you're into P stuff, that's fine. Uh, I hate germs. <laughs> this place is kind of big. I love it. Fishing shanty. Damn. I think this is the place, is it? This is the tattoo place? Dexy, it's me again. I think this drug lord is gonna kill me. If I mess up, he's going to kill me. You have to help me here. Call me ASAP. That is P Power. Real name ah. Paul Powers. Celebrity tattoo artist and reality TV. Just star. browsing. Well, probably better that he goes to sleep instead of, you know, me killing him. Now, how am I going to distract you out here? Not the guy I was hoping for. But... You know. That is not what I meant to do. Hey, 
Hey, bud, can you turn away from the window, please? Please turn away from the window. Okay, there we go. I'll look just like him. Take the coins? No, coins are busted. Okay. Blend in. Here we go. Hey, buddy! Same barman you just saw, right? I'm telling you, this is the worst day of my life. Absolutely the worst. Is that so? Well, it's this Rico Delgado character, isn't it? I'm supposed to be on my way to do some sort of tattoo cover-up work on him. Could be worse. You could be lying dead in a ditch somewhere. Well, well shit, that's the problem, isn't it? <laughs> Did you know he runs the biggest drug cartel in Colombia? I've had experience with the Delgado family in the past, yes. He's one of the most dangerous men in the country. One full it's, smooth, and I'm dead. It's so, right it's so cool that I can just blend in and boom, fucking conversation. Right, how am I... Hmm. You guys got a key around here anywhere? Huh. You have to get me the hell out of here. I'm stuck in some tequila bar. Yeah, There's no way out. I can't get out. Dexy, send help. Ah. Excuse me. Hey, excuse you, fuckhead. So Okay, I could change the song. I could change the song if you want. Can I play this? No. Oh! He's gone up to her. Never mind. This is beautiful. Fun fact, when Agent 37 says he has an experience with him, what he means is that he killed the leader in a previous game. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, he's going for a walk. There you go, buddy. Done me a massive favor walking over there, lad. See, no one's going to kill you. You're just going to go for a little bit of a sleep in the garbage. There you go. Hey, P Power! Woo! Wow, really? P Power. Can I check out your sleeves? Uh, yeah, about the sleeves, my dude. P Power! Oh, you. <laughs> I'm your biggest fan! You heard the news about the Moren? How they had. 15 guys been locked up in Mala, and yet all of them walked two hours after Brim broke in. Mm. And that's only half the story. Martinez has been asleep for months. Okay, so we can just walk up here now, right? Gets ignored, Sanch. What do you mean? What do you mean gets ignored? Oh, right, yeah. I ignored my biggest fan, true. Fuck him. I'm not Mason, but no, no, it doesn't. But it could be a little crummy around the edges. I don't know if I want to do that. All right, here we go. How does that work? You that power guy? Hang on, man. I hope you don't mind. All I did was bang the door with my fist. You're not 
Okay. Just wait for a moment. Have I got anything else illegal on me? A fish and a duck. Totally fine. Oh, we back, baby. Power? Yeah, should have listened to that a bit, eh? Come on, then. Tread carefully. Practically everyone here is dangerous. Not least Rico Delgado himself. I'm not gonna lie, I could probably kill them all. Don't worry. I thought there was three to- Oh yeah, there is. Put some ink on skin as well in my time. Of course, most of that was in prison, and not always on people who appreciated the work. Fair. You know how hard it is to tattoo traitor on a guy's forehead while he's squirming around on the ground like a worm? Not easy, let me tell you. Interesting story. Thank you for sharing. You bet. Oh my god, I'm gonna be dead I've got my ex girlfriend Margarita's name tattooed on my groin, and it's I wanna get a chance for something else. Oh, I just love your show. Oh, oh baby, we're in. You tattooed a heart on the arm at the set time, policeman, while they're administrating CPR. <laughs> it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. A great what? moment. I cherish the memory to this day. Oh, Don't see. say anything, chat. So. Rico has this tattoo on his neck, and he insists... Don't you say anything, chat. I'm not a fool, Mr. Powers. My nose never looked like that, not even before the operation. And sure, I've had a few ticks done here and there, but nothing as drastic as that. I want you to make it look like me, not some young skank. I'll do my very best, Mrs. Delgado. Ah, oh, Chico. Let me just grab a quick selfie with you, all right? Sure, why not? <laughs> Yay! Just look this way. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, que si. Wow, <laughs> we look so good together. She's gonna this post it to Instagram and then we'll be like, who the fuck is that? <laughs> Dude, that outfit cannot be comfortable. Oh hey, shit. So far, so good, 47. Now to leave your mark on Mr. Delgado. So, this is the famous P Power. Hi. Two artists to the stars. Hi. Yeah. You don't exactly look like you do on TV, do you? There's something different about you. Cariño. Don't insult our guest. He's obviously not been uh. sitting in a stylist chair for days, but this is P power. Who else would it be? Well, what about those cheekbones? The guy on TV. Did ah, the camera. Like that. Hey, Rico, enough. Are you warm, Mr. So camera. In post production. Just let the man work. Okay, fine. Whatever you say. Oh, that's too deep. Oh, that's too shallow. There we go. Oh. <sighs> Let's get this thing fixed. Hopefully it stays on. Cut. I swear to God. It's not every day we have celebrities visiting, you know? It's very distracting, kitty cat. Please I'm not gonna kill I really can't see what the problem is. Whoa, hey, Rico, don't worry. I've got this under control. Hey, tattoo guy. I'm watching you. One wrong move, you know, I start peeing. You need me. to keep still, Mr. Delgado. I wouldn't want to stab you by accident. You heard the man, Catalina. Leave us now. Fine. Have it your way. 
But that tattoo better look exactly like me when you're done with your new BFF. Rico. How am I gonna kill this guy? Hey, relax, Jose. We're fine. Better safe than sorry, boss. You're making me ah. nervous, Jose. Put that thing away. Afraid I can't do that, patron. This person might get the jump on us. So what are we waiting for, huh? I'm here, I'm ready. Get on with it. Hey, Jose, I need you to leave us alone now. You're too wound up right now. You understand? All right, boss, all right. But I'll be back in a little while if I don't hear from you, huevon. Oh, finally. So peace and quiet. Can I finish my work now? <laughs> do what you do best, man. You got it. See you later, bitch! Rico Delgado has been eliminated. Nicely done. Where the fuck do I dump him? There's no way a tattoo gun can cut deep enough to kill somebody. He stabbed him in the ear, mate. <laughs> Okay, okay. Think. Think. Missing combination. Combination. Alright, he comes back. I kill him. Panicking, I'm panicking. Is that Ebbs in the background? Yeah. You want me to flush him in the toilet? Okay. Wait. If I dump him, does it look like an, uh, 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 an accident? What do you mean, guys? Should I just, just throw him out the window? Don't think so. Save. Okay, we'll save Scummy. Out you go, buddy. Wee. What should I do? What should I do? Someone, please help me. You down. Yo, where did the boss go? I'm not sure. He looked a little dead. After I was finished with him. Okay, I look to you. Boss? What's going on over there? You hearing me? I've got a boss. Fucking <laughs> now. <laughs> <laughs> I got an idea. I got an idea. <laughs> okay. Not everyone will notice me. Okay, that's not what I thought would happen. Hey, hey, hey he's in there. <laughs> now you just avoid people that recognize this guy. Hey, buds.
Hey, there's a bit of an overflow, buds. You might want to go check that out. The fish come in handy. There you go. I'm the staff now. This is better. Much better. There's going to be so many less people that can recognize me, right? I will take that. And that. Just got fished. Okay, where's our next target? Looks like they're going back to normal, guys. Uh oh, not quite. Hey, I'll give me a scooter. Hey, Joe, can somebody hear me? Uh, not sure what happened, but uh, we got it. That guy's quite far away. Uh oh. Uh, you, 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 you doing all right? We're doing all right. Yep, just keep it going. Keep it going. Okay, cool. All right. Boom. I wonder what's downstairs. Hmm. You guys got any rat poison around you? I know you fucking love having rat poison everywhere. Is that not the same guy? <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. Oh my god. a lot of money. Is that Kive's Bates money? Yes. Oh, mate. I'm fucking swimming in money. Who's this going to distract, by the way? Nobody can fucking hear it. Never mind. It's got a limp. Wrong button. Uh, to be honest, he's a bad guy anyway, so... Uh, in you go. Beep boop. Hey, lethal poison pill jar. Let's go. Oh, shit. Hey, where did I get the key card from? You guys hiding anything around here? Accident report. These guys have a submarine. What the fuck are some of these? Ah, oh, I can't do the submarine one. Ah. Oh. Undying love. Now that I like the sound of. Did you just throw a can of soda at a man? Yes. You know what I think of that, Nia? <laughs> I love how like the, the light shines on the underside of my face. Uh, that's what I think of that, Nia. I don't even know what I was supposed... To, I genuinely don't know what, I'm, what I was trying to say there, but I just wanted to do it. Oh, he's gone. Let's go. Oi, oi, what's going on, lads? What's going on in here? That quest is 
not far away, but it's up. I love it. 10 out of 10. I know. It's so good. It's so comfy to be like this. I have to take the meaty bone. Okay, now up the stairs. You okay, Abs? Ah. Did you hear Javier stole the love letter Hector Delgado wrote for Martinez? For his penis or Martinez? Just keep walking. Did you hear Javier stole the love letter Hector Delgado wrote for Martinez? Have to jump. Think you're gonna use it after the month? Yeah. I think he hurt his leg in the process. Yeah, I heard. He even passed the letter around the basement bar at the party last night. Weird to think Hector and Martinez used to be an item. I mean, he's batshit crazy and she's so hyper luxurious. She can't even stand to be in her village mansion for too long. Talk about an odd couple. Yeah, I love to see her face if she ever found a letter. Huh. Rico Delgado's brother Hector is trying to win back his old flame, Uf. Andrea Martinez. Apparently, Hector has authored a rather slushy love letter. But one of the Sicarios foolhardily stole it from Hector's room during last night's party. I suggest you acquire that letter, 47. From what we know about Martinez, a declaration of love from Hector is bound to provoke a reaction. All right. Hello. Rumor has it, she hates him. That's my impression as well. Sad for Hector. Ah, back under. Okay. Is the cult redeems meant to be there? No. No, they are not. But, you know, as long as you don't redeem them, you're fine. Huh? Maybe it's on the other side? Oh, The icon was in the wrong place. That's why I wasn't looking at her. Whatever. Really want to hit him with me. What's up, guys? Just uh, walking around. Coming through. Hello. Hi, everybody. That's kind of close. Can I climb that ladder out of here? You finished the redeem on the hundreds left. Well, what are you talking about? Ah, there was an alternate way in the mansion, bruh. We back, baby. I suppose we don't really need to be in this outfit anymore. Or maybe we do, who knows? Look at that. That's a nice little house you got there. I have a letter from Miss Martinez. Alright, let me see that. Is that from Hector? I wouldn't know anything about that. Well, let me enlighten you. Hector Delgado and Andrea Martinez were an item once. Mm -hmm. Explosive and deadly. Things did not end well between them. He wants them to get back together. She wants them to go to hell. She's not accepting letters or gifts or anything from him. And neither am I. You put it on her desk yourself if it's so important to you. Oh, thank you. Wow, you made that so much easier, my dude. Oh, you 
going to do this? I don't think that is Andrea Martinez, the Delgado cartel PR officer and public face. Miss Martinez, I have this for you. A letter? Is that Hector's handwriting? I yes. don't know, miss. I'd recognize that junked up scrawl anywhere. I don't want anything from that bum. Uh, let's put it on her desk then. That's an illegal action. Well done, forty-seven. This should be good. Can I just poison this as well? It's actually alternate dialogue if you're not wearing a disguise where 47 just awkwardly states that he's the messenger. I like that. He'd be like, uh, 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 I'm the messenger? Oh, she's coming back. I do like the way that the AI works in this game. Like, once you trigger things, the, um, uh, the AI will turn around and come progress the story. Keeps it nice and smooth. Nice and streamlined. I know I said that earlier, but I'm saying it again, you know? What did I just find? A letter. Were my instructions not clear? Yes, Mr. Martinez. Very clear. I don't know how that happened. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. Burn everything that even remotely smells like that idiot. Got it? Yes, Mrs. Martinez. Ah, oh, to hell with it. Let's see what that fool has to tell me. You want a drink before you leave? I could just blast her in the head right now. Uh oh. Let's see what he has to say. Oh. Martinez is down. Good work. Oh, there's fucking piranhas in there. Oh my god. What the fuck? I just expected to just launch her off. I did not expect. I, I expected her to die, but not that. Holy shit, dude. Fucking hell. I didn't even get to know what he had to say. Don't worry about it. Nothing important. It was like, I love you. I want to be with you. You know what I mean? Chat, can you help me get down here? You're making me look small. Come on, hurry up. Get down here. Thank you. <laughs> uh, How do we get out of here then? Nah. Easy. Woo! Shortcut. Woo! Shortcut. Well, what we got left? Franco's experiments. So, we have the option of half-baked. Hmm. I, I want to find out what backpacker is. Someone's going to drink that poison drink now at some point. <laughs> Hey, that's not my problem, man. Gosh darn it. Hey, what's up, man? Sit down, relax. The universe will correct itself again, right? I don't know, man. I've been like smuggling this cocaine souvenir around the world, right? And I need to get it to this dude, uh, Franco. Man, it, it broke. It's supposed to be in one piece when I deliver it over by one piece behind the pharmacy, but it broke. Bummer, man. Makes All right. A drug dealer from Sapienza has been testing a new method for smuggling Delgado brand cocaine into Europe. 
Baking the substance into souvenirs, coated in a special anti-drug detection paint solution, the dealer has been traveling the globe, testing the method. However, he wow. accidentally broke the souvenir on arrival and needs to mend it before going to see friends. Dude. Dude came up with a fucking methodology and then tested it himself. Crazy bastard. I think it's gonna ruin the taste test. This Franco guy is like a bloodhound, but you know, with taste, not smell. You know? Yeah, man. Surprised they did not see that. <laughs> oh. Well, fuck. Small note with strange writing on it. It seems to detail some sort of plan to smuggle it through. Uh, uh, the, char the cartel's chief chemist for some sort of unspecified taste test. Right. Well, boys. Let's go find some poison. Shouldn't be very hard. Not gonna lie, though. That's a pretty boring way of doing it. What about... This one. What is half baked? <laughs> Can you please not talk about my fucking skull like that? Pardon me. My favorite. Okay, should be good then. Uh, how do we get there? What's Eb shouting about? Let's go to a stream. Lane, you should have gone minion at some point. I, I did, and there were all five of the team, and if I kept going, I would have been alone. Stand being shit. Ah. <laughs> uh. Back in the 90s, my brother used to steal my parents' soda all the time. One time, my dad had been using an empty can as an ashtray. My brother stole it and tried to drink it. He learned a lesson that day. Shit, dude. Stream Sniper Nebs? Yeah, yes I am. The sounds and lights of your surroundings caress your minds and spirits. Are they cooming? Another trouble to find his way here. Yeah. Come on in, my brother. Feel free to join us. Everyone is an equal in the eyes of your spirits. So we. Yeah, come on. Serve it to me. Anything. That's kind of scary, man. It is nothing to worry about. They are communing with your spirit guides. Sick hat? Yeah, I kind of want to. Friend of mine got roofied once. Kind of feels sick. Miller. There's nothing to be afraid of, amigo. I'm not afraid. Hang on, guys. Stay there. Now I could use that to poison the guy, or could you get out of the way, I buddy? Quite there yet? Do you? Like, I think you missed a few herbs this time around. Like, pretty sure you added more to the first batch for the others. I yes. got this, boys. All right, then. Come on, I like, get out of the way. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the soup better. <laughs> Bro, I want to go on the soup. Let me have a turn on the- Where's he going? He's going for a piss. Dude, come on, let me play with the soup. Get away from me, you creep. Yeah, uh, let me play with the soup, damn it! I swear to god, I will shoot everybody here. Thank you. Well, 
They're making some weird noises, dude. You trying to eat the soup? No, no, no. I'm waiting for them to eat the soup. Go on, have a taste. Have a taste, go on. Don't mind there's a frog in it. He's gonna drink here, right? Come on, have a taste. Yeah, there you go. You reckon? Guards, over here. I need some assistance. Hey, I know you guys are drugged out of your mind right now, so uh I'm gonna be the shaman, okay? <laughs> Going in. Hostile area? I'm the shaman. I'm supposed to be here. <laughs> what does it say? Solo personal autorizado. Autorizado. So, it sounds like the Delgado. Here we go. It's dropped a package over the jungle by mistake. A red box containing circuit boards for Jorge Franco's new cocaine processing machine. Hmm. Sounds like a workplace accident waiting to happen, providing Franco can get his machine working. I've gone a dance. Just grabbing a drink, bro. Okay. Another person with food allergies. What a coincidence. Giant lump of metal inside a shed. Either way, the box is gone. Right. Check this out, boys. What is it? I think you're right. I'm right up here. Ooh, yeah, the piranhas. Ooh. Alright, I'm gonna take your outfit. And I'm gonna... Just gonna drop you in there. Have fun. Never to be seen or heard from ever again. I'll take that gun too. Oh, baby. I look like I belong. <laughs> Oh, they didn't need to die, apparently. Shit. Whoopsie! I thought there was a kill where you needed to be the shaman. I think I have not done that. I think I've lost the opportunity to do that quest. Nice socks. Oh, yeah, I'm wearing British socks today. You can see my socks? Oh, there's the red box. I'm one of you, don't worry about it. How do I get down there? 
People make me walk around. God damn it. <laughs> hey, what's up, man? I'm from the uh, the drug field. I'm just... Uh, yeah, I need the circuit board. Right, I'm going back. Bye-bye. Nice, nice. You got eyes everywhere. <laughs> Fair. Alright boys, let's find out what uh what happens with this one. Okay. Did he notice me or he didn't? What the fuck? Dude, that was close. Gonna pass around the back of you, my dude. I don't know. Hold up a second, private. Shh. Where'd I go? Where did I go? <laughs> Locate the cocaine machine. Cocaine. That's too small to be in here. I'm sure no one will notice this. <laughs> oh, I'm such a dick. Whoopsie! I thought I was being so fucking smooth. Alright. New costume is needed. Wait, was that? That's barrels for the sugar cane, right? Or the, the cocaine. I think. Man in bright blue uh, disappeared in green. In indeed, indeed I did. You have a recent save, right? Who knows? Who knows? But my identity is not. Yeah, I'm sure it's fine. Oh, make sure you don't mess with Franco's new experiment. He's trying to distill the essence of some rare flower from the jungle, and he's very fragile. That's what he was yelling about earlier. Yes. The experiment has gone wrong a couple of times. We have to go out into the jungle to replace the plant each time. I get the sense he's running low on samples. Huh. Oh! Oh, no! Oh. Sorry, buddy. You saw too much. And you go. The distance between being smooth and smooth brain is very short. It really is. In this instance, very smart. All right, I don't need this rifle anymore. I'm sure nobody will notice it on the floor. I want my wrench back. Take that. I'm assuming this guy... Well, let's go find the cocaine machine, eh? Oh, dude, I'm fully concealed being stood up here. Hey, guys. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's repair it. Time to bring Franco down to size. 
engine is working now? I thought it was working. Yeah, boss. Well, Franco will be pleased with that. Senor Franco, your machine is finally up and running. Come by and have a look at it when you have a moment. Oh no. What am I going to do to him? Cocaine brick, let's go. <laughs> mulch time again. I'm feeling like it might be mulch time. Yeah, it's got the front door here. Run away with my cocaine. I see he has a bit of a strange hobble. We found a weapon just lying around. What's the meaning of this? Yeah, well, he's busy a sec, so. Which way is he gonna go? God, there's so many fucking guards that can spot me. This might be incredibly dumb. Uh, excuse me. You just got cocained. <laughs> there's no fucking way. Holy shit, that was close. Hey, let's go for round two. <laughs> oh, I have this gun gear. It's crazy, man. I'm gonna drop it in this bush. What's our main man doing? Okay. Who is inspecting the cocaine machine? Bloody hell. Uh -huh. What? Yeah. I need a cup of tea like right now. <laughs> I need a cup of tea like right now. Same. I think you messed with the sequence on this soil. Is that a frog down there? Oh, he's lost. There was a flower on the path. What color was it? Red. Mm. Must be this way. I don't know. I'm going to go back to the machine. Yeah, we'll go back. We'll, we'll uh... We'll fuck around with it. I'll turn the power back on. See what I can do. Alright, there's no an there's no interaction with the machine, but I can blend in here. Oh, maybe he'll turn up. Maybe he won't. He's very far away. Hmm.
Just his mission story completed. Yeah, it got disrupted. If it was going to happen, the cyan icon would still be in the top left. Oh. Well then. We'll have to do it the old-fashioned way, won't we? It should be queued up, so once he's he's got on his rare flower... Hmm. Might as well take that in there. Uh, and now I know why he's lost. It's because you had taken the flower, I believe. Oh. Oh, I see what I've done to him. I understand now. He is... He's high as tits. Yep, guess we'll have to go say hi to him. Doesn't know up from down anymore. That's what you fucking think. That is what you fucking think. Get him, fish. <laughs> Dr. Livingstone, excuse me. Oh, ooh. Yeah, give me that. So this one over here is locked. I wonder why. I'm gonna go look at it. I like how I like how for some of the kills there's like little cutscenes. Do 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 do. Wish I didn't fuck with the sample now. Just killed the poor old man. Ah, yeah, he had it coming. He's a dickhead. Missing key. You guys got a key? We are good. <laughs> oh, where's my key? You guys got the key? There it is. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> uh, awesome. Uh, There's a secret exit that requires a long process involving doing many of the story missions. It's basically Mary Poppins. What the fuck? calling card yeah i like that I, I do like that mission but i much prefer the missions that you do in like civilian areas it's very fun zero stars let's go give me level enough so good I've done 13.6% of the three-headed serpent. <laughs> Jesus. I unlocked a lot. Stars are overrated. Making ghost towns are where it's at. 
Oh, are we going to England? Hello, governor. Mission state. Spotty. Oh, a fantastic Tuesday. Neutralized. Militia transport network disabled. Location of primary target unknown. Team chasing several leads. End message. Encrypt and send. Very nice. I feel like getting zero stars is impressive. Yeah. strong as you they have to pay for what they did it needs to stop backstory you need to stop if my source checks out we can prove the board knew about the chemical leaks we'll have grounds for a retrial it won't make a difference they're too powerful they're not the devil nancy just the company they're not above the law, don't you see? This is bigger than James. Those bastards killed 80 people. And they got away with it. Think about what that means. No one's untouchable. No one's untouchable. Yeah. No, oh, the airplane's still there. I highly fucking doubt that. Highly fucking doubt that plane would still be there. Mom? Dad? 82 people. Just saying. Had it coming, yeah, 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 yeah. Bruh. <laughs> we got what we came for. Move out. That's fucked. That's fucked. What the fuck? <laughs> Poor guy. Alright. Um, continue. Chasing a ghost. That's coming from you. Look. Good evening, 47. The militia has released yeah. <laughs> a tape, outing the existence of Providence to the world. This was a fatal mistake, and our analysts are tracing its origin as we speak. In the meantime, we have a lead on Lucas Gray's top lieutenant. Turns out the Delgado cartel's counterfeiting unit was creating fake IDs for the militia, and one operative in particular stands out, Wazir Kale, an infamous South China sea pirate better known by his nom de guerre, the Maelstrom. Ooh. The Maelstrom and his cutthroat band of outlaws were the scourge of the shipping industry in the post-recession years. But his reign of terror came to an end with the disastrous 2014 hijacking of the supertanker, Francis King. Chinese elite forces stormed the ship, resulting in the deaths of a dozen sailors and most of the Maelstrom's crew. But Carle slipped away unseen. The Maelstrom's connection to Grey is unknown. But we believe it was he who carried out the audacious killing of a Providence CEO in Shanghai, along with two reactivated members. The hell of happened to that guy? Game, Shaw, his arms and his legs seemed to look like they were melting. And Darwood Rangan, the gang's old cashier turned dodgy movie producer. Shaw, Rangan, and the Maelstrom form Lucas Gray's Eastern Cell. They, they should are be a good. Strike team and stopping them is our client's most pressing concern. Unfortunately. The elusive maelstrom appears to have vanished into the seedy underbelly of Mumbai. This should be good. Cradle of his criminal legend, and no one knows his whereabouts or what he currently looks like. So, a bandit queen, a showbiz oh. charlatan, and one certifiable ghost. I shall leave you to prepare. Oh, 
I don't know what the guy looks like. Oh, shit. We're going to be here a while. <laughs> All right, we'll take some fish with us. Um, yeah, let's get some emetic pills. That kills them, right? If you kill everyone on the map, you'll get him just saying, true. Very true. Wow, what the fuck? There's so many smuggle locations. Okay. Detective Kaif on the trail. Yeah, boy. So how is this game? I haven't seen it before. Hitman? Oh, it's fucking incredible. I'm, I'm, this is... I'm having so much fun. <laughs> Three and a half hours have already flown by. Ematic means make them vomit. Ah, shit. One of the most densely populated cities in the world, home to more than 12 million people. If you wanted to disappear and hide from the world, this vast city is perfect. Cool. The maze-like sprawling slums offer secret paths and surprises around every corner. The elusive maelstrom knows. Seeing a bit scorch cobra. Locating him will be a considerable challenge. A place to start could be the slums where his former gang, the Crows, has recently risen from the ashes. Darwood Rangan will be easy to find in his half-finished tower, wrapping up his new film called Mumbai Hero. While Vanya Shah has ensconced herself in the overgrown remains of an old train. Don't forget to do the DLC for the first game if you haven't already. They're fun. Okay. It's called this labyrinthine part of the city home. So choose your approach carefully. All right, here we go. Where do we begin? Where do we begin? Can go absolutely anywhere. I'm going to sound like a sore thumb. Shiny chrome dome with a barcode on the back of my head. Sir. I'm afraid you don't have the right clearance. Sorry. Sorry. I reckon this is going to be real spicy. So I could look up the missions by pressing F1. Or we could try to just bump into them naturally. Oh my god. I cannot wait to see that new Rangan movie they're shooting over at the tower. I think that's what it's called. 47. Our intel suggests the Maelstrom is hiding somewhere in the city slums. I've marked the headquarters of the crows on your map. Crows. Yeah, what does it look like? <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll go find out. Forty-seven. The street gang known as the Crows are on high alert. They seem to be on the lookout for potential assassins and will be suspicious of anyone they don't recognize. I suggest you are mindful around them in the slums. That is war. Acha ek baat bata. Any idea why the boss wants to know when the barber shop is open again? Yeah. Saga, the barber, has a side business dealing in information. He basically has every snitch in the slums sharing the news with him. Boss wants him on our side. Hmm. Bobby even came down to the hideout to be shown a picture of the boss so he'd recognize him when meeting him. Oh, God. Oh, the secrecy is so strict. This barber is tangled up in some shady business. Let's go. But even more interesting, he may have seen a picture of the Maelstrom in the hideout of the street gang known as the Crows. That picture would be very helpful to our cause. It would. You know the boss. He says having a secret identity is key to what he does. I honestly don't understand what he means. The guy's a bit of a mystery to me. Okay. Let's have a listen to his voice then, shall we? It's me. It is imperative you notify me as soon as Sargas Barbershop is open again. He is an excellent source of information and I want to make sure he understands who he's working for now. Signal me at once when the shop is open. 
So let us find a way to get to the barber, which is upstairs. I cannot believe that Wudrangan donated that TV to the Why am I suspicious? Stephen roll with me. I'm a good boy. Everything is fine. Every oh shit, everything is not fine. Okay, here's the plan: strangle and brick, strangle and brick. Here we go. Oops. My brick. Oh! Oh! We can't have that. That was too much killing. That was too much killing. <laughs> uh, it's got to be stealthy, boys. It's got to be stealthy. Tanking those bullets. I tank those bullets like a boss. Okay. I've seen someone do the entire game without being seen by anyone for even a single frame. Suspicious not. I've seen that video. When I say I've seen that video, I mean I turned it on when I was falling asleep. So. Haven't really seen that video. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. After your racetrack spree, I am shocked at how little killing there has been. <laughs> what can I say? Alright, let's see. We get in. Man, these guys have shit security if I can just climb in like this. Why do they have a beak staff? It's down there, okay. Okay, this time I got it. Because I'm going to brick him. Yeah, 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 that's right. Go to sleep. <laughs> Anywhere to dump the body? Uh oh. Uh oh, there's nowhere to dump the body. I'm sure nobody will path up here. What the fuck? Oh, I don't have a screwdriver. Well, are you sure that's the trick of the barber? Yeah. He was literally about to shit himself when we brought him down here. Oh. I'm surprised if he even remembers what the boss looks like now. But Charles, he didn't bring the picture with him. No. The boss didn't want it to leave the hideout. It's still down here. I did not notice him, I'm not gonna lie. Delving straight into the heart of darkness, 47. Good luck. Whoa, was I not supposed to, bro? Who the hell are you? Hi guys. Fuck. Fuck. Why am I not paying attention? 
<laughs> and then she walked right around the corner into it. I do that to you a lot. That's fair, dude. It's quite common and I slap on a video and fall asleep. Alright, where's our little barber man? What are these? Spaghetti sauce? An idea. See you later, Baron. Just message me. Ah. Oh, good. Huh. I need a key. What the fuck is this? Alright, which one of you has got the fucking key in? Fab Nino isn't here, you know what that means? We can have chalky milk in bed. Oh, that sounds banging. Is he rehearsing how he's gonna talk to his wife? <laughs> don't, don't, don't mind the noises, boys. Don't mind the noises. <laughs> don't, don't mind the noise. <laughs> Aha! Here we go. And a note addressed to Sagar the Barber. This looks like a very recent picture of the Maelstrom. Ooh. With this in hand, picking him out in a crowd should be possible. You could also investigate the barber shop and see what is going on there. Oh yes, I want to be the barber. Right, I got the intel, right? I'd like to see the fucking picture. How's that? Oh well. Ooh. Okay, they're by there. What's in that room that they're guarding? want to find out what's in here what is this
Is this his room? It's time to get him to soundproof room. Uh, it's because we both got our doors open. Hostility gone. <laughs> Wasn't there another door that I couldn't open that I needed a key for? Or am I losing it? I love how loud the doors are and no one hears them. Well, that's the thing. They're not really suspicious of the doors opening and closing. They'll only be suspicious if the door opens and they notice that I do not belong. Ah, uh, we're out. Back on the streets, baby. Okay, let's go find this barber shop then. Forty-seven. That man there. He resembles the Maelstrom. All right. Him for a visual ID. Forty-seven. That nose. Those eyes. <laughs> that can only be Wazir Kale. That nose. Those eyes. Okay, well, I'm going to go be the barber. Nice hair salon, bro. Has anyone seen Barbin Sagar? I have a job interview today, and I desperately need him to shave me. Sit down now. Mister, who are you? What do you mean, who am I? Oh, you okay? Your team will attack me. Yeah, we can hear you shouting. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah? Why? What happened? Oh no, okay, one sec, one sec, one sec. There we go. <laughs> Pause the game, you need a hug. <laughs> What's wrong, what happened? I had like almost 250 barb, and the Zeta took my kill from me. You know the Zach's passive? Yeah. And we just killed the blobs in the war? Yeah. She deliberately took it away from me, <laughs> and then at the end of the game, we were gonna win the game. Zack was like bubbling on the floor and I was killing him and I was about to kill him and then Stan ended the game. Ah, oh, Stan. <laughs> I had as many assists as my son of support. <laughs> Told you you're obsessed with kills in the league. I, I need them. I'm an ABC. I need them. You needed them while the game was being ended? I wanted it because I got the title game. Do you want food? No! You don't want food? My calorie intake is full. Sag. What you. are you doing? Bad. You need to open the shop. Hey, hey, hey. Stop don't get it between an addict and their fix. True. What are you doing? You need to open the shop. There are people waiting outside already. I, I, I can't remember what he looks like. Guy the crows wanted me to provide information to me, you know. Their boss he showed me his picture in their hideout two days ago. I was so stressed out. I thought they were going to kill me or something. I can't remember his face. But what if he shows up and, uh, and I miss him? Kind of looks like a human version of, e uh, of an Ewok. Thanks. <laughs> what if they hurt me? What will happen to you? Or if they decide to burn down the shop like they did with that other guy with the metal recycling? I won't do it. I don't know how to take that. <laughs> really sorry, guys. No way. Just quit it. You're going to kill someone. Oh, this good. I am you now, my friend. He walks to the bears of space. Okay. I look nothing like this man. He has hair. And a beard. I'll be taking that. <laughs> Open the barbershop. 
Okie dokie. Time to go to work. I don't have the key to my barber shop. Perhaps I will go back upstairs and find the key that I seem to have misplaced. Oh, where did I drop my key? Oh god, I just realized what I'm about to do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Maelstrom looks like and expect him to show up. Patience and shaving cream is what's on the menu now, 47. Shops open, sir. Thank you. I really need a shave. Fucking hell, that guy needs a shave. Okay, let's give you a little shave, shall we, sir? Oh my god. I came here because I had heard that Bavin Sagar was a source of character looks psychopathic. All the rumors and all the hidden news of the city. I'm sorry to disappoint you. You don't have a license for that, that's true. Okay. Good as new. Hey Baba, that is a tighter shave I've ever had. I get the fuck out my chair. Thank you, my friend. I might give that guy a shave afterwards as well. He really fucking needs it. All right, I'm ready for my shave. Make it a close one. Oh, it'll be real close, my friend. The tides are changing, my friend. Can you feel it in the air? Yes. <laughs> Infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done, 47. No rest for the wicked, however. On to the next one. There we go. Hey. Where'd my man go? Hello. You have time for a shave? No, where's Harry? There he is. Bring your ass over here, bro. Damn it. Alright, get out of here. I'm afraid I'm a little busy right now. Oh, yard. Maybe That's later. Too bad. Sir. Okay, you're busy. I'm sorry, I'll come sir. back another Not right time. now. <sighs> Harry, where are you? Me fuck off. Not, Forget this. I'll go somewhere else. Yes, that's what I want you to do. Fuck off. Oh, you over there? You want to shave? Oi, mate! Hey, any chance for a shave today? Not Piss right off. Now, okay. bicep, bicep. Yes! yes. I'll be right in. Come, come, come have a shave. Don't worry about the blood. Oh, it's no blood. Ugh. Yeah, you just sit on the blood. It's fine. Let's go, let's go, Harry. Let's sort you right out. I have some exciting news for you, Mr. Sagar. I'm yeah? Well, my cousin Arjun, who drives a cab here in Mumbai, he had an interesting customer the other day. He swears it was none other than the famous hitman known as the Kashmirian. Can you believe it? A world-famous hitman right here in Mumbai. Sounds plausible. Tell me more. Well, he dropped him off near the trolls. He recognized the man because he's really interested in true crime fiction. He was close to asking him for an autograph, but he decided against it. <laughs> Probably a good idea. That's it. You're done. Wonderful. My face is like the bottom of a newly born baby. <laughs> <laughs> you are looking fantastic, my guy. Woo! Go 
goddamn eyes open. <laughs> Moving on to the next area. <laughs> what the fuck? And I'm out of there, baby. Woo! All right, let's go find our other targets. Dude, the fact that his, his identity was concealed was really fucking awesome. I shot him, bro. Ah, right, where's our next target? Man, that person is fucking fuck. Whoa, you look amazing. You look so amazing. I want... I want to be you. I need it. I need his outfit. Can I go past? Really comfortable with your proximity right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to get past you, that's why, bro. I'm losing my patience. <laughs> Become the holy man. Oh shit, I'm back here again. Let's go. Oh, mate. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we are looking beautiful. And we're back. Back of the barbers. Going somewhere, sir. You need a mm. I am the holy man. Right, where am I supposed to be going? Why is there two people laying down over there? Look sharp, jerk off. Oh, I did that. Okay, I see a target over there. We'll go there. We'll go there first. Hi there. Greetings, sir. Can I interest you in my fine wear? Wait, he sees through my holy man disguise? You there, sir. Please. One moment. Yeah? You look like a discerning gentleman. We have the finest wares in here. Best cloth, finest cuts, dresses in all sizes. Come in and have a look. Perhaps sure. something for your wife? Yes? Oh wow, this place is lovely. Wait. Uh, they've demanded that a local tailor make her a gown, but the tailor is reluctant. A dress to die for. Oh, Vikram. What are you going to do? Listen, I, I have to go out for a while. If anyone asks for me, just tell them I'm not here. But I want to be the holy man. <laughs> Look at me. I <laughs> like fucking amazing. Alright, how the fuck am I going to get this guy's outfit? Hmm. It's gonna be a tough one. Oh, but he's gone down an alley all alone. Oh no. Shh. 
Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Excellent. Let's find out what kind of dress a woman like Vanya Shah wants. I'm gonna take your key. Probably need that. A coin for me. Ooh, that was fucking close. Okay, so obviously those guys recognize me, so let's not... Yeah. Ah, it's you. Did you bring hey, the clock from Miss Shah? Come on, let's see what you have in your pockets today. Uh, one sec, one sec, one sec. One sec. Turn out. I... <laughs> Wait, hang on, hang on, one sec. One sec, one sec. One sec. <laughs> What else have I got in my fucking pockets? <laughs> what the fuck did I bring? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. <laughs> ah, it's you. Did you bring the cloth from this shop? I did. If you wanna pass, you need to be frisked first. Oh my fucking god, what else is in my inventory, man? Ah. I didn't drop both. There we go. Ah, I thought it would have just dropped both. Did you bring the cloth from Miss Shah? Come on, how suspicious was that, bro? Stand still and it'll be over soon. They just watched me walk away twice. <laughs> okay, go on then. Okay, let's find out what dress she wants then, innit? Inny bat. Ah, it's you. Wait, hang on. Oh, I wasn't even meant to. Oopsie, I wasn't. Um, I was running ahead like an idiot. Ooh, money. Ooh. See how easy money can kill you? Even I was like, ooh, money. Perhaps you will be able to source a roll of the right fabric at the local cloth market. I shouldn't go downstairs. Three times actually. <laughs> it's you. Ah. You bring the cloth from it's you. Did you bring the cloth for Miss Shah? Coming through, coming through. Hello, sir. How much of these? Ah, you're back. Ah, my friend, you have chosen well. Now, we have the best prices here. What do you say to 140 rupees per running meter? Does that sound fair? <laughs> no? Nothing? Ah, I can see you're a man of refined taste and a skilled handler. My kids will only eat rice tonight, but it's yours for 105 rupees. It's a deal, yes? Wow, those eyes are really burning into me. It's, uh, like you're just looking straight into my soul. Okay, final offer now. 90 rupees. 90 rupees per running meter. That's my own cost. I, I really can't go low. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ah, good, good. <laughs> Take any of the bundles, please. Um... Cerulean cloth. Hey, need a new shirt? Great. Thank you. Come again. Thank you. I wonder what happens if I give her like the wrong color. Off with your head. Ah, it's you. Did you bring the cloth from Miss Shah? Yes, I have it right here. About bloody time. Come with me. I wonder if you could have gone lower, so... Well, I, need to frisk you first. I mean, he did say final offer, but yeah, he could change his mind. You can get it for free? Oh. Okay. Clearly, I'm go. bad at haggling. Wait. Yeah, if I shoot him, I can get it for free, 100%. Or I can just grab it and run. Miss Shah has been dying to meet you. It's not wise to keep her waiting, you know. I won't disappoint her then. That is a good idea. She's not been happy with the other tailors. <sighs> a word of warning. Just play along with her eccentricities. She can be rather dangerous. Thank you. Oh, I look fabulous. Follow me. Good man. Do well and there will be a lot of money in it for you. I know. <laughs> I know. I heard she likes to keep people. So, sometimes for days. Here we are. 
Is she just go through there. Like, like, the queen is waiting for you in the garden. The queen. My queen. Trying to prepare for the celebration. But we've been without water and power for more than eight years. That is Vanya Shah. It's self-appointed queen of the Mumbai slums. I see. We cannot manage. Hmm. I see. Well, the whole city suffers under the water shortage. Your husband is dead, is he not? <laughs> yes. You just yes. don't have any money in your wallet and you just stare him down, okay. And your children are already working elsewhere in the city. Yes, but you have nothing to offer me then, Mrs. Banerjee. I'm sorry, but water and power are precious assets here. I barely have enough for my own needs. Are you sure? You will have to make do with what you have. I understand. Thank you, my queen. The elusive dealer. Here at last. Let's have a look at the cloth you've chosen. Cerulean. I want to make sure the color is the right color. Yes, of course. Here it is. Excellent. Finally, some progress here. Come with me. I want you to take my measurements while you're here. Smart work, 47. Shah will want to have privacy when measuring for the dress. I'll leave the final execution Sir, up to you. I'm afraid you don't have the right clearance. Hey, fuck you, bro. I'm gonna go measure. Suck my balls. I can't tell if she... Is she wearing a hat? You there. Leave us. I want some privacy. Let's start the measuring right away. If you didn't bring a date, then pretty said you weren't near the date. Burn victim. Oh. You can use that. Oh yeah, so she is. Damn. Hey, I was eating up leftover pizza, Saj. Hiya. Oh, she's gone through so much. Well, what are you waiting for? Get on with it. I need her to leave. What am I doing? Ah, measuring tape. Relax your back, please, Miss Shaw. He knows so much. I wonder if she'd be like, what are you doing? <laughs> are you struggling to get my measurements? <laughs> Barbara Anna Taylor, man of many talents, I know. I'll just measure your arms now, Miss Shaw. Turn around, please, Miss Shaw. I need to measure shoulder to shoulder. You've probably heard about the other dealers. How some of them ended up in the gutters because they didn't please me. This dress is important to me. Well, not the dress itself, but what it represents. You see, there are those out there who do not want to pay tribute to their queen. I need her to leave. People who think the value of their lives can be measured in money. It started with one man, but these things spread like ripples in the water. Soon another, then a third. Tributes to your queen keep you alive, not money. <laughs> Eventually. I'm, so I'm sorry, I gotta knock you out. Excellent work. <laughs> Just one target left. Let's bring this one home. I'm so sorry. <laughs> You're not dead. You're messed up. You're actually trying to get it up before you. <laughs> Someone help me! Help! I need some help here! Shit, 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 shit. Shit, 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 shit. Any clues about our man? Like the water be your friend. Oh, fuck.
<laughs> Imagine hearing, I'm sorry, I have to knock you out, and just fade to black. <laughs> Fuck! Hmm. What is this? Lethal poison pill. Why has she got that in you? What is that? Oh, it's a picture of Maelstrom. Does that look like him? Can I take your outfit? I can't? The fuck, man? Well, I hit you with a fucking iron fall then. Ay, ay, ay. We have to clear out this place of an iron then, I think. What's this? <sighs> Alright, how am I supposed to get out of here? I mean... These guys don't recognize me, so... Anyway, just a barber running around with an iron. No biggie. Just gonna leave the area now. Wait, trespassing where? Trespassing where? Huh. Where's this target then? All the way over there, okay. Hey, what's up guys? Hey, how's it going? Nice. Oh yeah, shit, I'm not a barber, I'm a tailor. What am I on about? Hang on. As if they didn't see the gun. They saw it, it went in my pocket and they were like, Ah, it's fine, it's fine. Man, that, that one is far away. Not too far that I can't hit him with my fucking iron. Okay. We're up there, okay. Oh yeah, nobody ever found that the actual barber's body. Interesting that one. Hello, sir. Have a lovely day. Can I come in? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll go pick it up. Really thought that would open the gate. 
Are all the missions in such a small area? Small area, my ass. What? Where's your key card? Uh, I'll go down swinging. <laughs> you want to go? I'm not gonna lie, that was kind of fucked up. That item was too deadly. It was, yeah. Good, 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 good. Thank you, auto saves. Thank you. Hey, with this mission, guys, do you uh, do you get like a a different target when the guy is like a ghost? What can I do with this? Like, is it does the guy look different every time, or is it just the same guy? Oh my god, every dentist has one of them. Is this a dentistry? Ooh, a crowbar. Ah, right, here we go. Different guy every time? Nice. I wonder what the car battery is for. Maybe I can look like I'm working on a car. Hmm. That could be a good distraction. Think, 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 think. Think. You know what? I'm being too tunnel vision. There's probably another way in. I don't care about Hi guys. You need clearance to pass. You don't have it, buddy, so go away. <laughs> There's another way in. There is another way in. This is one way of getting in. Hey, what the hell are you doing here? You can't stop right now. You there, come with me quickly now. Okay. Sorry, sir. Sorry. I didn't think the other guard would come here. I mean, maybe... Maybe it was pretty loud. I don't know. The car battery. Here we go again. What's up? Oh, me killing? 
walked in on you changing. <laughs> True. True. Hey. Gotta get a seat to come up. There we go. That'll do. Okay. I won't fuck it up this time. I hope Darwin comes out and says You're not fit to enter, sir. Yeah. And don't let me see you here again. I'm plenty fit. Look at me go. You guys love it. You love it. <laughs> One last neck snap, true. <laughs> I thought I was knocking him out, but I just ended up like snapping his neck. Final warning, buddy. And then I and then I was dead as well. Hmm. I love I could just walk in like. I wonder. What the hell do you think you're doing? <laughs> this is a restricted area. You're coming with me. <laughs> Understand? Yeah. Understood, sir. Uh. That's right. Keep walking. I will. <gasps> there we go. Hey guys, how's it going? You do not recognize me. Alright, so I have to get up this building. I mean, I blend in, so... Not a problem. Can I jump that gap? Fuck. <laughs> Bollywood crew, baby. Uh, really sorry about this, my guy. He won't die, right? Yeah, he's, he's alive. Cool, 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 cool. Imagine someone does that to you in real life, by the way. <laughs> You'd be like, well, who the fuck are you, man? Okay, if they fall down there, they're definitely dead. Am I almost there? Yes. How do I get higher? Is the fan good to go? I know they're still trying to find the right line to shoot, but in case they do, we need to be Hello, sir. I'm ready for my day, at my first day. Me. Gregory Arthur, a famous <laughs> Broadway star, is apparently late for a photo shoot inside Rangan's unfinished tenement tower. Hang on. He uploaded a selfie on social media about half an hour ago. Hmm. The Mumbai Food District. He's likely still there, 47. Wow, and he looks so much like me. Excellent. Very good. Wait, why is somebody searching? Um, why am I doing this? Hey, listen to me. Please help. There's something going on. Something terrible has happened. Please, you've got to do something. Good work. Now stay out of our way. I'll fucking kill you. No, will someone help me? What's going on? Go. 
Oh shit. <laughs> you never seen a guy hang from a fucking wall before? Bastards. <sighs> I don't even know what to say about that. It's totally normal. Oh well. Even if it isn't normal, you don't have to fucking shoot me. Who does that? Still trying to find the right lines for the shoot, but in case they do, we need to be ready with the deck. You bet. I have to. I mean, I'm a great dancer. I'm not. All right, buddy, get on with it. Nia cursing Kaif. Nia. Why did you make me lose, Nia? What do you mean? Okay, I'm gonna order some food. Where the fuck can I even order from? Burger King? Eh. They are searching, yeah. What are they searching for? I'm sure nobody will find me while I order my bacon burger. That's good. Now, really project. Like, real project. Burger King ain't really it. It's all right. Smoky chimichurri loaded king fries. That sounds like it's... Perfect. Calorific. Please. I'm going to order that. All right. Now think shark. Burger King. <laughs> I want to be one of the guys with the wings. Okay, what's a fast way out of here? The hell's that? Oh. The missing script? Oh. I see. But how do we get him there? <laughs> Am I supposed to be up here? Sorry. Definitely not through here. Get out of my face. Well, well, well. Have a good day. Well, well, well. Looks like a sink's about to overflow. <laughs> Come on, I am not in the mood for this. Oof. All right, in you go. What's going on? Are we all okay? Are we all panicking? What are we panicking about? Because I stabbed the guy with a, a screwdriver. Come on. By the way, what a nice touch to that he Always saw me in the mirror. Okay. That's a terrifying last few moments, by the way. What's this? Oh, that's that guy. Dude, that guy's got some fucking vision on him. Oh, 
consume my time. Oh, where's he going? Hi, bud. Sir, wait for me. Where are you going? Oh my god, you can't even drop the light fixture. Oh, I could just eat him. That is Darwood Rangan, <sighs> producer of mediocre movies and a full-time criminal. His brutality is overshadowed only by his giant ego. Oh, he's going back up. Thank you for teaching me that jab cross left hook combination last week. You know, I made good use of it last night. Is that right? Good to hear it, Mr. Lang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, one of those stunt people, he decided to get a. Hmm. It's still doable. I think you would for it, Mr. Lang. I think you underestimated It's not far away. Belt him with a cricket ball. That would also be fun, but no. Uh, so it's, that is a window. So it's just down there, is it? Ah, this is how I didn't find it. One seemed to go and we're done. Looks like the fan has been set up again. Do you know why they haven't shot it yet? Karishma threw the last copy of the script into the elevator shaft. She doesn't want to do the scene with Rangan. He still wants to do the kiss. Oh, are the nerve of this guy? Chutia, he's a creep. And Karishma isn't having it. The production of Mumbai Hero is coming to a close. But it seems there's a spot of trouble. Lead actress Karishma Hassan has refused to do a kissing scene with Rangan. And has got rid of the script by tossing it down an elevator shaft. Shame. The scene features the use of a large industrial wind machine. Could be worth investigating. Uh, yeah, um. Man, that elevator shaft. Whew. I think she's crazy to pull something like that. First time I'm ever entering an elevator shaft. How did I get there again? Ah, here we go. So who's searching right now? Oh, I think that's like in a different area. Alright, is it down here? No, I guess not. Unless I'm blind? Alright. Disguise yourself as Bollywood crew. I can do that. Oh. <sighs> Quite literally blind. Quite literally. Alright, where's my Bollywood outfit? I think it's up the stairs on stage, please. and then 
Up the stairs again. I know, blind as fuck, boys. Honestly. And then up the stairs again. Dodge the guy. Through here, and there is my disguise. Wait. No, it's not. It's the bathroom. That was just a guy I booted to his death because I'm a sick fuck. <laughs> Silly me. Is that outfit compromised though? Hi, sir. Let's have a find out. No, pretty good. I just saw a guy in an agent's outfit walk into the bathroom with a cricket ball. And then a guy walk out in a crew outfit with a cricket ball. I found this. A script? You found it. Thank you so much. Not a problem. Listen, the scene needs the fan to be running. Run over and man it, will you? Right before the scene starts, I'll signal to you to turn it on. Just make sure the safety is on and you don't go above the indicated power. I'll round up everyone. You got it. Good work, 47. Darwood is hurrying down now to act out the final scene with Hassan. Oh no. Let's make sure he doesn't Ladies run out of everyone, wind. We have found the script. Get to your places. We are ready to shoot. All right, All right everyone. Hang on. Mr. Rangan is on his way. We just need to get this one scene in the can and then that is a wrap. You didn't notice that, right, mate? Here's that last What's line up? Kept missing. I'm yours forever, and I'll kiss me hero. Right, right. There we go. Well, um, what's my motivation here? Like, why kiss him? He is a foul fighter, after all. You love him. It is a pure, intimate love that has bloomed over the course of the weeks that you spend in captivity. The evil witch queen had Anna, your mind all of those years. Isn't this going to have collateral? You realize that he is your true love. Your hero. I don't know. It sounds kind of unrealistic to me. <laughs> I mean, sure. Stop being a Madonna. And and, and Stop I being a diva. Grateful, but a kiss? Maybe just a firm handshake. Or a hug even. Oh, you're full of love, Krishma. Mumbai has it's this script. Just follow the script. If it's shit, it's shit, you know? It is not the evil person portrayed by the witch queen. Her attempts to kill him through the use of the assassin have failed. This is the beginning. Mmm. Together. I think it's a beautiful moment and it requires a kiss to see Has I ever stopped you before? Oh. No. What was the last <laughs> line again? You're right. Yours forever. Now kiss me, hero. Shit. That's some shit writing that is. See you coming over. Oh, here he comes. Here's our big man. I can see him on the mini map. Time to get the show on the road. I'm here. My lips are ready for the final, most important shot of the film. Charisma, are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. What? You're not going to punch her, mate. Kiss her. No, I want her to suffer, boys. So... Show on the road. Start the fan. We need wind, people. Turn on the fan now. I am not here. I am not here. All right, somebody else start the fan. And here's got a bit of stage fright. <laughs> you know what? I won't be the killer. I am not a bad person. He is a bad person. Oh! <laughs> Mission completed. 
Time to find an exit. Damn, I missed him. She almost walked in there. Damn. I got an idea. Check out the ball. Uh, rats? <laughs> All right, new plan, new plan, new plan. Go check out this fish. Need something I can hide against. Think, 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 think. Oh, this will work. Here we go. All right. Let's go get my ball back. There we go. Do I want to try it? I don't want to die. Go on, go look at it. Ah! Maybe you got a coin. <laughs> People love coins. Yes, that's great. Gotta be a penny around here. How do I get her to go in the wind? What's this player? Okay. Go check out the iron. Yes! Where'd she go? Are you coming on to me? <laughs> because I don't want this. <laughs> oh my god. Curious. Very curious indeed. Get in trouble for her either.
Where did they even go? Did they go right into the water, did they? Uh. I feel like there's multiple ways to kill people. Hang on. Right here. I just need somewhere to hide to do it. Can't hide there. Shit, what happened to him? <laughs> there we go. I am satisfied with how that went down. <laughs> Whoa, crazy freak accident, yeah. Shit, what happened to him? Ooh. All right, where's my exit then? Perfect. Perfect. I find the game, I love it. It's so fucking funny. What a brilliant game they made. <laughs> Nice. Smashed it. Could you have used the crane? Probably. Mate, catching the guy whose identity was hidden was fucking easy. Oh, yeah. And there's so many ways I still haven't done this. Oh, food's almost here. Let's go. I am fucking starving. Zero stars. I'm a fucking legend. There's so many areas I haven't seen either. Jesus. Soviet research fund, the Institute for Human Betterment. It looks deserted. The place was abandoned after a fire in 89. Then, only a few weeks ago, it was acquired by an anonymous investor using cryptocurrency. Oh, currency. food's here. You guys can watch a cutscene. Enjoy. He's here. Be careful, 47. The breadcrumbs were almost too easy to follow. It could be a trap. Not a trap. You came home. I knew you would. You've come a long way, forty seven. And even now, you don't remember. This place. This was our prison, where father trained us, shaped us into killers for Providence. Uh, you don't remember. They ripped it out of you, wiped it away, but I do. I remember everything. You're a terrorist with nothing to lose. 
you'd say anything. Jesus Christ, the cutscene's still going? Sorry about the noise. I know it's difficult. You never miss your mark or question your function, but we made a pact. You and I. How do you find him? Do this. And we both lose. They grew up together, right? There was an incident. That boy, he died. He lived. Because of you. Don't you remember his name? You know this. Deep down, you know. He invited him, okay. What was his name? Subject 6. Your name is Subject 6. And what is our purpose? To take them all down. Who are we taking down? Providence. Anyway... <laughs> I feel like I didn't miss- I- I- that that story I could have guessed. I actually, in fact, I assumed that was the case. All right, I got a Bogor. We were gonna tear it all down. The institute, <laughs> and they were roommates. Everyone who'd ever hurt us. It's a tiny ass burger. The partners grew paranoid. Made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. Ortmeier was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to them. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> but he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first Constant. If we find him, if he's still alive, he's our way in. You don't know who he is. But 47 does. <laughs> That's what this reunion is all about. Show them. You're just gonna hand it over. Our one bargaining chip. Olivia. <sighs> Fine. 47's memory was erased. Irreversibly at the time. But after Ortmeier's death, his estate was acquired by the Ether Corporation. And How they wipe his memory? It's a long shot, I know. This is not how it works. We don't just join the revolution. ICA is neutral. We don't take sides. I hate to break it to you, lady, but neutrality is a side. It's the side of the status quo. People have died. Civilians. You align yourself with terrorists, murderers. Sometimes even monsters serve a purpose. Look, enough. You have a choice. But I made mine a long time ago. I will finish what I started. Oh, she lying. Subject 47, most gifted of all my boys. So you're the pick of the litter. Tell me about the incident. The subject ran away, he and another boy. The instigator was punished accordingly. As were all the neighbors. My men did what needed to be done. It won't happen again. 
bring your house in order, Doctor. You won't like the alternative. Hmm. Oh, these chips are wild. What the fuck? I remember. So wild, I need a fork. Oh, but it tastes banging. What the hell? Shit, dude. Wait, which mission am I on? Another life, right? Gentlemen, let's go over the plan. The first constant is none other than Janus, the legendary Cold War spy master, a KGB senior officer and head of the sixth column special branch at Lubienka. Janus is a certified genius and expert of counterintelligence. He retired from the KGB in 1988 when he fell out of favor with the Kremlin and defected to the US. Shortly <laughs> after, the Soviet Union collapsed. Now, it is unclear when Janus stepped down as the Constant, but since 2004, he has been a resident of a quiet community in suburban Vermont. Mr. Gray. Right. So here's the catch. As an elite KGB agent, Janus was trained to withstand interrogation and torture. No Damn. amount of pressure will force him to disclose information he doesn't want to. Instead, we will need to search his home for clues. But if Providence learns of our presence, the game is up. Uh -oh. So we frame Janus, make Providence think he was the real Shadow Clan. Correct. I will file a false ICA report, claiming to have traced a number of calls from Janus's house to the Institute in Romania. The case will seem clear. Mr. Gray was only a figurehead. Janus was pulling the strings all along. And by eliminating him, we will have neutralized the militia once and for all. However, for this subterfuge to work, you'll also need to deal with Janus's security detail. A Providence Herald and former Secret Service agent by the name of Nolan Cassidy. Intel describes him as diligent and inquisitive, and we cannot risk that he contradicts our story to his employer. Seems workable. I certainly hope so. Everything depends on this next move, 47. You made this our fight. Now let's even the playing field. Do it, baby. I feel like this is going to be a weird town. Always got to bring my fish. And the remote concussion. No, no, no. The pale duck, which I never fucking use. I am ready. These were good chips. Uh, oh. Whittleton Creek, Vermont. On the surface, a picture perfect suburban dream. Wide roads, golden maple trees, and verdant lawns. Most residents here are white collar professionals, ranging from university staff to government employees. Most. Ah. But not all. A gated community, is it? Janus's unpresuming home is protected by a host of bodyguards. And intel shows that the fragile former constant rarely leaves. You despise this mission? Uh oh. Nolan Cassidy, on the other hand, roams the neighborhood streets. A recent arrival, the dutiful Providence Herald, is busy making threat assessments and settling in with the security team. Now remember, this is about more than just revenge. Janus is the key to bring down Providence. So get in there. I would hate to live here. Good luck, 47. I have an armed personnel around all the time, would piss me right off. I'm sorry, but I literally look like a fucking hitman. I stand on like a sore thumb. Because his head looks like a thumb anyway. 
47. I've marked your map with several points of interest. We're running this mission with very little upfront intel, but these locations could provide clues to help you obtain the information you need. I'd love to tell you about a new candidate who might just change your life. Yes, sir, a total game changer here. I'm listening. One good on you. Be sure. Wonderful. Uh, well, I'm sure you're aware that voting season is upon us again. Mm -hmm. um, and if you're anything like me, a recent immigrant to this fine country, the candidates this time around just aren't very um, savory. But we have a man here today who's about to change all that. I don't care much for politics. That is exactly why Blake is out ringing doorbells today. He has no stakes. All right, Aiden, I'm heading off on my tour now. He just stopped now make talking. Sure you hand out a lot of those flyers, all right? And by a lot, I mean all of them. Got it? I'll do my best, Mr. Blake. Knock him dead. <laughs> oh, don't you worry. I practically own this town. Everyone here loves me. I'll be back later. Not such a great guy, then. That is exactly why Blake is out ringing doorbells today. <laughs> okay. He has no stakes in Washington. No connections to the establishment. No allies hidden away in lawless groups that pull the string around the world. <laughs> Excuse me? Hey, pick that up. <laughs> Are you six years old? <laughs> that is it good on you. Be sure to vote come election day. Okay, I'll be back. Is it good on you? Be sure to vote come election day. And feel free to spread the word. Damn, I've got nothing to open here. You guys got a screwdriver in here anyway? I like the music for this map, by the way. Broad spider senses, boss needed him. Oh, he just fucking stopped mid convo. And he was like, Hello, boss. Hi there. Are you a registered vote? Pardon me. Anyone got a screwdriver? Would you like a fly? Or perhaps, if you have time, I could tell you more about him. Ooh. He's a fascinating man with many bold ideas. Blake, the chairman of the Homeowners Association? That is exactly hey, why stop Blake fucking flirting and go check out the faucet. That is exactly Blake, the chairman of that is exactly Blake, the chair. That is exactly Blake. That is exactly Blake. That that is Blake. That that Blake. That Blake, the chairman of the homeowners association. If he's running for office, God help us all. That man effectively tried to cancel Christmas once because he felt it crossed the spring. What was that? Go over there and see what that was. No that way. is exactly what that is out ringing doorbells. Here's a flyer for you. Mr. Blake has many important initiatives to share. <laughs> that worked out swimmingly. For Blake at the upcoming elections. That is exactly why Blake oh, is out sake. ringing doorbells today. Right, where's that hammer? Have a fly. Charles Blake the Third appreciates your support. Mm -hmm. Hey, who is throwing stuff around here? Come on! Holy shit! I've got a body here. Investigating. Stand by for further information. Fuck! Fuck, I thought I did so well. Shit! I wanted to go knock doors. <laughs> ah! <laughs> God damn it. I was so close. Ah! <sighs> Be sure to vote come election day. Feel free to spread the that is exactly Fuck get out. Sure to vote come election day. That Feel free to spread the word about Charles Blake the third. Oh. 
Okay. So, nothing is as it seems in this village. I think. Neighborhood barbecue party. I guess everyone's armed, do they? Mm, my belly is rumbling a little. Want to go inside? Looks like everyone's invited. That would be a good time to twist the <laughs> No problem. I'm in. Why am I in? I don't know. This house is a lie. Everything about this place is fucking sus. What can you tell me? We had a guy poking around the backyard earlier. Claimed he was there to look at the frogs. Pretty sure it was that same fatty guy. You were, you know. Frogs. What can I say? I'm now you. Take my wrench back too, bitch. Oh, is the... Oh, the camera. Your aim is fucking abysmal. Go on, take me out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I fucking accidentally snapped his neck again. Well, not that guy, but like, you know. Shit. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> like, I'm gonna take this guy down now. Ah. Be sure to vote come election day and feel free to spread the word about Charles Blake the third. Here's your I want to avoid him saying that. Nah, fuck it. That. Exactly Here's a flyer for you. Mr. Blake has many important initiatives to sell. All right, let's try that again. Straight into the garage. No way I'm getting away with this. Oh god, that's not somewhere I can dump the body. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. There we go. All right. Okay. In you go. Whew, no problem. All right. I am part of the crew now. Hello, guys. How are we? My God. This whole neighborhood's a fucking lie. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't risk it, boys. Good work on the undercover agent, Spencer. They've managed to blend in very nicely. Thank you, sir. They've gone entirely native. You'd be hard pressed to distinguish them. Oh, wow. It runs deep, boys.
Okay, why is this place filled with fucking cameras? The hell? What is in here? Jesus! So much stuff around here. Oh, you dirty little perverts. Ooh, I'll take that. Very nice. Right then. Cool, nobody heard it. I didn't have to do that. Can we kill Janice by turning off his oxygen? I say we fart in it. <laughs> Lethal. Killing a non-target? That's a deduction. I know. I know. I, I literally, right? I shot him and I went, why the fuck did I do that? Not gonna question the blood? Okay, well. What? Oh god! Oh fuck, I did it again, man! God damn it! I keep forgetting about equipped items. Holy shit, that was brutal! Dude, can I do this with the whole house? Hmm. Very interesting. Well, at least this one's not dead. There we go, buddy. Looking good. Would anyone else like to investigate the TV now, or are we all good? Letter from Janus. A letter from Janus to someone called Zoe. It looks like a draft, and it's full of explicit descriptions of how unhappy Janus is with Zoe and her sister, having been appointed chairwoman of the Ark Society. That name before. This is a good find, 47. Ooh. Cassidy looks to be a gun enthusiast. The room looks like it's outfitted with a lot of security oh alarms. Look at all this stuff. No, I don't want to do that. Stupid. Stupid fucking cameras. Oh, dude, our target's gone. <clears throat> me next, me next. I want to inspect it. <laughs> Are you sure? I might accidentally kill you. Clearly, I'm too good at this. Oh, he's over there. Okay. <clears throat> Hello. Ooh. You coming back, sir? Yeah, what's going on with that laptop? Oh, here we go. It is what it is. Fair enough. I might die, but you know, it is what it is. He either shoots me or he strangles me. That is Nolan Cassidy, former Secret Service agent and current Providence Herald. Motherfucker. Cassidy is assigned to protect Janus. Cassidy's about to get fucked up. Let me know if you see any of the others slacking. So, um... 
Is he just gonna stand there? Oh, he's got no one to talk to, is he? I fucked them all up. You gonna go upstairs or? Shit. Building Cassidy is down. Good work, 47. Janus awaits your attention. I thought I was gonna kill both with one bullet. I'm not gonna lie. Surprise, motherfucker. <laughs> huh? Who saw it? I need you to move now. Okay. Who saw the body? What the? Nah, we can't. Nah, too much death. Too much death. The camera? Mm, it, it felt like it wasn't quite in it. Like, I don't think the camera can see the steps. I don't know. Let's try it in a more subtle way, shall we, boys? Simply firing the gun at people is not... It's not great. Go sleep, go sleep, go sleep, go sleep, go sleep, go sleep, go sleep. There you go. Be glad I didn't make you go perma sleep. How dare you. Whoop! <laughs> Whoop me! Shit. Ah! No is down. Good work. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Boys. That didn't quite go to plan, did it? Is this thing meant to be silenced? It doesn't feel like it is. Oh, it is. I mean, if it wasn't, they would have heard it downstairs, right? Okay, check this out. Check this out, right? It's fast as fuck. You ready? Need, Need war. Need war, huh? Come here. Come here when I'm talking to you. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. A little bloodthirsty? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Don't drop the body there. Yeah, there we go. Right. Whew. Whack a mole. I like the sound of that one. Right, they come in. What do you mean, body found? What do you mean, body found? Who? It's like I'm too late. Now, who's responsible? Hey there. Go hey. On. Jesus! I need some help over here. Port the package out of here. Move! He's in the vehicle. Follow me and stay. You're gonna regret this. <laughs> um that was very awkward <laughs> why does his body jiggle like that i'm very high speed chunks of metal were entering his body you know i hate this mission already eh. it's all right so far oh no my mouse pad is wrinkled you know when it's like a little bump in it ah Oh, no, 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 I can't deal with this. There we go. Ooh, there we go. 
Okay, this is the one. I got an idea. <laughs> Alright, back to normal. Back to normality. Yeah, I wanna I wanna know where this story is. Whack-a-mole. It's that way. I don't know how they saw the body, guys. This That shouldn't have been possible. The fuck is this? Muffin stand. I bet you're an agent, aren't you? I have to tell you. Hmm. Strange. Oh. Just checking if he had a gun. Don't trust anybody, boys. Where's my fish? <laughs> She's important to the story, right? Right? Oh, it's locked. Uh oh. Stay there. Stay there. What is your fish's name? Can you describe what it looked like? What, you think I'm some NPC, bro? Okay, she got knocked out for no reason. I have a license for. License? Don't bring it with you. You can't just confiscate my property. I need it to get rid of an aggressively invasive mole in this poor old man's backyard. Calm down, demolition man. Unless it's a flesh-eating mutant mole, you don't need explosives. We're gonna keep- One of Janus's gardeners has decided to clear a series of mole tunnels using explosives. I applaud his enthusiasm, but sadly, local police have confiscated his equipment. If you were to find it, 47, it might be the perfect way to rid the world of Janus. <laughs> now that's a Florida man. Okay. Oh, come on, man. It's standard procedure. You stuff the holes, and then you blow up the tunnel system so it collapses. Is it standard procedure? Sir, if the American police force looked to YouTube as guiding principle for standard procedure, I'm pretty sure civilization would have collapsed a long time ago. God damn it. <laughs> All right. All right, nobody gonna see this. Here we go. Where can I dump you? Maybe in this bin? Maybe, maybe in the bin? Um... We don't have guns on our back. There we go. Okay. You guys don't mind me being in here, right? Go, 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 go. All right.
Come on, boys. That was fucking sick. Sick in the head. <laughs> um. Wait, who found the body? I think we could do with the paramedics here. I found one lifeless body. Over. How the fuck did you find a lifeless body? There's no fucking way. You in some kind of accident? Stay put. I'll be back. Up on your feet again, my friend. You're okay. Left the body front door. He was out. He was outside the building. He wasn't in. <laughs> Fuck. It's fine. I'm only compromised in this building. Okay, what the fuck is going on down here? Okay, everybody here is fucked up. I don't like this village, man. Frank Schmidt's bedroom key? Anyway, happens a lot in this version of Hitman. Ah, it is what it is. Anyway, they've gone back to no Bok? back to normal. I don't know what I'm meant to do. Oh, we have the keeper. Okay. Obtain an explosive item from the item stash. There should be re- Wait a second. Hi, guys. Hello, sir. Can I come in? Excuse me. You're not allowed here, you know. Yeah, and stay out. <laughs> All right. Wanka. Can I go in here? No. Hmm. Is there a pizza on the roof? Oh my god, there's actually a pizza on the roof. Nice. <laughs> I think, 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 think. How are we going to get to that police car? I didn't think so. Hey, yo! You got no right being here! I'm not gonna let this slide. I'm getting help. You just wait here, mister. What's the problem? I can do this. I saw these suspicious guys snooping around. Much appreciated. Seen any tangos around here? Hey, this is the classic American suburbia I know. Uh, I should know. I live here. It's not the life for me, my friend. Let's try that again. Going through. All the way over here. Get my stuff. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. That's it. Safety's off, buddy. Stay calm or be dead. Show me your hands. Ah. On your knees. Get it. Shoot it now. Oh, God, <laughs> <laughs> that poor guy. Fuck, I guess we just die. Wait, I can just load. From the drug den. <sighs> I never know us, I know, right? Who needs eyesight anyway? <sighs> the the on stream chat has died again. Way we love it. We love to see it.
What is this place, man? Oh, that's a place to dump bodies. You say jump in the pipe hole. I don't know about that one. Maybe there is a way under there. I don't know. I think it was called Murder Basement. Oh. Right, let's have a look at that pipe. Does it actually lead anywhere? I have a feeling it doesn't. I really don't want to fuck up that worker just for blowing my cover. Here we go. So I know this guy does a nice little circle, right? Damn, I'm out of stuff. Come on, buddy. Do something else with your day. Oh, it is vaultable, mind. I'm really sorry, sir. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to let you pass. Orders, you know. Asshole. You'll never come through here as long as I'm alive. Now get the fuck out of my face. As I said, I'm really sorry. That was super aggressive. You know what? That was fucking easy. Who am I compromised to? Oh, yeah. Uh, I remember now. I'm being silly. Exactly, Sandwich. What did Sandwich say? Can't be witnesses of all the witnesses dead. True. The way you can see the flash in Kai's webcam as well. I know, right? It's like that flash, uh, flashbang meme. Okay, infiltrate Janus's garden. What's up, man? I'm supposed to be here. I should hide. <laughs> Ask the guard for instructions. Okay, well, I gotta wait for this toss of the move. I might have to take this guy out. Go to sleep. Good night, sweet prince. Oh yeah, because I'm compromised, don't I? Hi, buds. I understand you have a mole problem. You still going, yeah, boy? Let's get straight to it. The sooner this is fixed, the sooner I won't have to listen to Mr. James's complaints. Follow me. Yes, sir. Where we going, lad? As you can see, we have a mole issue. I know a permanent solution might take some time, but if you could just fill the holes by the end of the day, it would be great. Come find me when you're done. Obtain an item to block the mole hole. So another one by there. Right. Um, uh, why is this guy a clue? Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to fuck him up at some point. Oh, yeah. So the other day I accidentally asked Janus about that oh. in the basement. Big mistake. <laughs> Haven't you learned anything yet? How long did he talk for? Oh, I can't really Glad I didn't fuck him up. Zoned out eventually. 
Not as bad as that time I used the gramophone near the house, though. Man, that tune kicked off some old memories and some long-ass stories. He dragged me down to the basement and showed me all of his memorabilia. You know how it was. Interesting. Maybe you should try to spark some of those old stories, for a second. Who knows what secrets James might be hiding? I see. Well, I've learned my lesson. Nice, a wrench. <clears throat> we could definitely block it with a wrench. You didn't see shit. <laughs> Just doing my job, buddy. Oh, I'm not supposed to be inside. Okay. Can I block it with a blueberry muffin? Okay. Block it with a baseball? When those moles are allergic to blueberries, I think you're right. Ready, Sabs? Hey, did you drop off the surveillance tapes on Jane into the house? Cassidy was after. Hey, hello, Remy. Yeah, added them to the file. What a stupid system. Record the surveillance in the attic. Bring the we have a doggy. Oh, she's coming on me. Is she? Okay. Hello, baby. She's not gonna stay here very long. Cassidy is certainly keeping a close watch on James. I'm willing to bet those surveillance tapes hold interesting huh? information. Mwah. Use Janus's gramophone and locate his surveillance tape. Oh, it's a good dog though. Say hi to everyone? No. Wanna get down? Then you, I know you do. I know. Go on, Ed. Go on in, baby. Jump. I can't tell if I find the quiet or the noise more distracting. I know it's just lots to be tracked. Go to bed, then jump up. Come here. Go to bed. Go jump up. Where are you going? Hey. Come on, over there. Over there. No, don't just sit there. <laughs> She's sitting behind me now. Eh, she'll work it out. Oh yeah, I need an item. You guys got any stuff here? Could really do with some... Ugh. Back to normal. Oh yeah, I can just block it with a shovel, right? No. Yeah, I have a gun. <laughs> Where's the last mole hole? Is it this one? I have a flash grenade. There we go. I'm done. Great. Let me have a quick look. Um, you're not gonna look what's inside the holes, right? A bit unorthodox, maybe, but she got the job done. I'm getting it to Janus so he can inspect it for himself. Hey, tell Mr. Janus the molehills have been fixed. All right. Janus should be here to inspect the work soon, 47. They're like, hey, where'd the gardener go? 
Do you think they'll blame me for a mole hole exploding? Well, I guess we're not doing the clues. Mr. Janus. Janus. Cold War spymaster and the first Providence Constant. I wonder how much he remembers. How little he cares. Yes, Mr. Janus. Gardner took a bit of an unorthodox approach, but they do look filled to me. Well, I think I'll be the judge of that myself. Thank you very much. Looks good, I guess. You know, life gets dull when you're old. Dealing with moles back in the day was much more exciting. Yeah? What'd you used to do? Oh no, Mr. Janus. Oh no. <laughs> Death feels like an easy way out for him. <laughs> Shit. Oh. That was a class way to kill him. Woo. <laughs> You're fucking flying. JHQ, I have nothing to report from my current location. ETA at extract in seven mics. Control, out. Okay. Huh. All the boys here now. Come on, do you copy? I'm at the location now, and I have nothing to report. Over. Affirmative. Moving on. Out. Oh my god. Got nothing here. Keep those eyes peeled. All right. Please don't walk in here. And I have nothing to report from my current location. Over. I, th I thought the C4 in the mole hole might be a little bit... extreme. Command, I have nothing to report from my current location. Over. Oh, great. From one danger to a new one. Ooh, that was close. Whew, all right. Are we taking that? She has no idea there's a body in her freezer. <laughs> oh, it took so long to answer the door. Maybe there's no one home. Hmm. You ever fucking snitch on me again, you fucking asshole? God damn it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got that one out of me. I'm 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 okay now. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> so oh, do you ever stop again? <laughs> There we go, down into the basement, into your little murder basement. All right, in you go. No idea what the fuck that is. Now I know what it is.
fucks it to you, buddy, huh? Station eight, all clear. Anyway. She had it coming. Remy, what was that little cry you just made? Remy. Oh, fuck, they finally found her. Well, then. <laughs> He's like, bro, oh, what happened to my partner? So, the information I'm looking for, is it inside this garage? No. Where is it? Okay, the surveillance tape. Oh, shit, it's all the other guy? Can I just climb the fence? Yes, I can. Hi, guys. What's going on? What's going on in here? hate this fucking town. Oh, jeez, darling, I'm so hungry. Have you seen those beautiful patties back there? And Mr. Wilson just keeps standing behind the grill, even though there's clearly no more gas on it. I know, it's weird. Why doesn't he go grab a new canister? I'm telling you, these new folks are strange. I know. You see that Cassidy guy snooping around here? I know, right? The party, three already place is Why fucked man go inside it's open to everyone yeah it's strange all right oh, do any of you guys live in a place right where you could have like a party and you would just leave all your doors open and people would come in that's like a proper middle class thing isn't it come on in all my neighbors sounds like a made up name if you ask me a block party I don't even got a fucking clue who my neighbors are. <laughs> Maybe it's like a culture thing. Hometown used to be like that when I was a kid. I'm thinking it's a culture thing, isn't it? Oh, I did not pay attention to what that was then. Oh, shit. Uh... Cheers to my favorite streamer. There we go. Thanks for all the entertainment. Oh. Got the way, loser. So what's going on here? Where are we going? There's one. All right. Why are we doing this? If you could just hook that up here. Oh, wow. Will you look at that? It's good to know the kind and helpful people still exist. Yes, I have to start flipping burgers now. Yeah, get on with it. Find the missing server. So oh, will you look at this? The furniture looks brand new. Well, they did just What the fuck is this cam in the top left? Normally don't buy new furniture every time they move into a week. Ah, you need this room? Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, wait, I... Ah! <laughs> Honestly, what the fuck was he doing in there? So weird, man. She in a room all on your own, you f fucking strange dude. Come here. Get in the fucking closet. There you go. 
See you later, loser. I feel really sorry for this family because they are not agents. They are normal people who are suspicious of these weird people who have moved into the block. And they're gonna find a body in their closet. Oh, you guys are hungry? You guys fucking hungry? Yeah, I got you. Alright, folks. The food is ready. Won't they notice me poisoning this? Yeah, have some food. You wanna try something different? Hey. Mr. Cassidy. Who wants a taste? You? Go ahead. Go on, bud. Have a try of that. Thanks a lot. My pleasure. There you go, buddy. I'm serving people, motherfucker. Hello. Can I tempt you with a little like snack? Well, huh? looks pretty busy here. I'll just wait my turn. Let's hope he likes his food. Much appreciated. Mm. Sure. Nom 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 nom. Hey, you seem like a great guy. That's not, yeah, yeah, fuck it. You can just die in the street. Excuse me. You should try this. There's an open really spot, so. die for. What's, what's this? Enjoy. Made it just oh. for you. Thanks. It's got a little kick to it. <laughs> ah, I mean, oh. Sometimes people just choke on food. It's crazy. Hey, you guys want some food? Command, command. Did you do this? Oh shit! What? Look at me when I'm talking to you. What's this joker up to anyway? I'm talking to you, sir. I'm not going to tell you again, understand? Oh, Fucking run, boys! Hey. Oh, yo, 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 you guys are really hurting. Stop, please. Ow. Ooh. You made the obvious connection. I know, right? I'm so sorry, sir, but... He had a gun! He was a bad man. Woo. I can't aim! Oi. <sighs> There's nobody over there, right? Well, this went to shit quick, didn't it? Bitch. Ah! <laughs> Okay, this time I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave. You know what I mean? He's dead. I served there. Actually, I got a better idea. All right, folks. Hello. Why don't you give this a try? Go on, bud. Have a snack. Oh, thanks. The pleasure is all mine. Yeah, my no, no. Fuck off, mate. Pardon me. Can I offer you a little treat? Come on, hurry up and chow down, my friend. You're welcome. 
Oh, we're wearing gloves and everything. We are hygienic. You should try this. I remember reading somewhere before that wearing gloves when with food is actually even less hygienic. But I don't know why the reason was. Whoa, what was that? <laughs> Whoa, it was crazy, isn't it? Hi there. Care for a taste. What in the world? Cause you don't wash him. Yeah, I think that was it, wasn't it? Thanks, I guess. Enjoy. I'll see you in the bathroom. Thank you very much. Hey, hey, you're sick. Okay, you really should see this. Is that? Right, Cheers. that's him dealt with for a little bit. <laughs> you're supposed to wear gloves of wild hand raw flesh before throwing them out and putting on new ones. Okay. Shit. He's not far behind. I gotta distract him somehow. This is so fucked up. Oh my god, this is so fucked up. And that is Nolan Cassidy taken care of. Both targets are confirmed killed. Oh man, I took a bang and shit in there. How would go in there? <laughs> Hi. Uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, it's just fucking surveillance tape. <laughs> oh. Brilliant. I can't believe how well that worked. I served him the chips and he gave me enough time to get in there. Oh my god, the guy's still in the closet. Oh shit, I'm not wearing the attire. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, hi, sir. Excuse me. What are you doing here? Now follow me, okay? Okay, sir. Um, sir, I've changed my mind. There we go. Uh, come on in, buddy. Where should we dump you? Right here. Can I dump them through windows? That'd be wild, wouldn't it? There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, bud. He's a third of his name. That is not someone you want to vote for. Anyone is who is the second, the third, junior, anything like that. Don't deal with those, but don't deal with them. That is. Unhand that corpse. Um. All good now, yeah? All good? Oh shit, 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 oh shit. Oh fuck me. Oh fuck. Oh fuckity. Oh fuckity fuck. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, you don't see. Smooth.
You saw me and did nothing. Now you're gonna die. Oh, this is surveillance tape. A recording of some sort. The note mentions another house. Perhaps Cassidy is using one of the vacant buildings as a base of operations. Hey, what's up, man? Wouldn't go in there anytime soon. <laughs> took a... Took a bang and shit. <laughs> Uh Stay sharp. What's up, boys? It's definitely got to be this building, isn't it? This. Oh. Hmm. Lead pipe. Hello, everyone. Hello, how are we? Yeah, I reckon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, well, well. Figure what out by the end of the third game. Despite my recommendations, I would appreciate an explanation of the reasoning behind the decision. I was a long and rather complicated discussion to undertake over the phone. Your request was put in How to disable cameras. I shoot me now. Go on, how do you disable them? We're on the second game. You may as well tell me. In that house, the security console uses all the cameras disabled. Ah. To meet with the constant. This is just the sort of thing we're looking for. Oh, I'm still missing one clue. Okay. Which way did I come in? Ah. Can I slide down here? No. Wee. So, bitches. Oh yeah, I hit the body, didn't I? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, right. Use my use doors, my ass. Every level has a console somewhere. Yeah, I think I remember somebody telling me about this. The issue is that I can't be asked to find it. Hey, is another one of those holes in the floor? out and wants to talk and the problem is he just won't shut up always ranting about that damn lawsuit against Janus and waving piles of paper at me as if I give a rat's ass about their problems let the judge sort it out you've done it a few times by accident oh between Janus and a local resident might be just what we're looking for Batty lives in number 432 pick one all right doc sorry I'm just stressing out here Batty please do what you can all right Okay. You know the exterminator guy who's working on Batty's house? Same guy who just did Cassidy's, right? Yeah. So I let him use the green shipping container to store some chemicals. Uh huh. I asked him if it was poisonous, but he assured me that it was only a sleeping agent. Get this. He told me that he doesn't kill the bugs, he only sedates them so that he can set them free later. Let me get this straight. He's an exterminator who cares about the lives of insects. What a weirdo. I thought so too. But then. He told me this story about his pet cockroach, Pedro. It was genuinely a Is this the guy from the last game? What the fuck, man? 
Hey, where's that guy going? Whose fucking house is this in, bud? Oh, this guy's having it. Hey, mister. You're not allowed to be here. Oh, yeah? Oh, it's just Batty. Well, I found your documents. Is currently engaged in a civil lawsuit with another resident of Whittleton Creek. James Batty, the plaintiff, wants Janus to stop his annual landing of a helicopter near the local creek. Batty claims it interrupts the nesting birds and a species of frog that has been declared endangered. Must be a very important trip given his poor health. Good work, Fortison. We now know Janus is meeting with the Constant at an event related to the Ark Society. And we have an approximate date as well. I oh, they finally found that body. We're close to the finish line. It's time to end this. <laughs> I just... The fuck you looking at? I tried to distract him so I could subdue him quietly, but he saw me, so he needed a fist to the face. <laughs> Pardon me. Uh, on the news in this mission, it talks about Dino Bosco, a target for a bonus mission in Sapienza, where you kill him on a movie set. Very fun bonus level. Ooh. From the first game, right? No stars. Let's go. Let's go, boys. And why was that? Non-target kills. <laughs> it, the, in, the, in fairness, though, right? That one way of completing the mission literally forces that to happen. No way. <laughs> the Ark Society. One of Providence's more obscure outfits. Stars are invisible because you're so stealthy. This? True. A survivalist club for the global elite. Billionaires preparing for a global collapse. And now we know the Constant will attend their next gathering. So where is it? That's the catch. The report is redacted. No names, no location. So it's a dead end. I can't track them, not without ICA backup. Now, I'm no big shot analyst. But it seems to me, Janus was the Ark Society's founder. So chances are, they'll want to pay their respects in private. Track the coffin. Worth a shot. I see. You're right. It comes back in flashes. Fear, anger, but like it happened to someone else. <laughs> your gift and your curse. What they did to you. This game has some of the best levels, well, but the cutscenes are just PNGs. Yeah. Now. The cutscenes are a real step it. down from Hitman One. Hi, just a bunny. Yes. Found something. What are we looking at? The ass end of nowhere. But this is where Janus's remains were shipped to. Our Square was screwing him on finances place. when this came out? Oh, that sucks, dude. Not bad. So we stake it out. Await the next gathering. Then we waltz in and kidnap one of the world's most powerful men. Without ICA backup. Like I said, yeah, boy. It's a long shot. We'll take it. We'll take it. Yeah, the levels in this game uh, have been some of my favorites. New cutscene. Let's go. Are we going on the Ark? 
How did you not see this coming? My God, we came this close. The old man could have buried us all. Our families. Do you think you feel more betrayed than I do? Get some perspective, please. Janus is dead. Lucas Gray is about to join him. And a cornered animal is twice as dangerous. Let's be perfectly clear. We were not exposed. The threat is neutralized. We are back on track. Even so, from this point on, we expect you to take... No, there is no way I'm doing that. How can you question my loyalty? In case treachery is contagious. Do you really want to do this to me? God, his voice is so weird. Is there a problem, Secretary? Do you really want to do this to me? No problem whatsoever, madam. The fuck? Here's to loyalty. Okay. My man on the island confirms that the constant has arrived. We head out at sundown. Here, in case the crew get ideas. Why are you doing this, Mr. Gray? You had so, a chance to walk away. He's Why injected something into his neck. A year ago, I'm working security for this banker, Cobb. Only to find out he's a Providence operative. I've been running for decades, only to wind up where I started. We've all got barcodes on the back of our heads. Most people just never notice. <laughs> You're right, okay. 47 told me about your parents. How did they die? Car bomb. Sorry, 1989. Company named Blue Seed didn't care to pay for their mistakes. But I like to think no one's untouchable. I'm... I'm sorry for your loss. You feel it. Don't you? Unlike him, you feel it all. Everything you've done. It's a dangerous thing. Having a conscience. Still streaming? Yeah. It's not the longest stream we've done. Six hours? Uh, yeah, the Ark Society. There we go. Attention, gentlemen. Our yeah. source on the island just made a critical discovery. The Constant has a poison chip embedded in his neck. A failsafe in case he's compromised. Damn it. Uh, we should have expected something like this. So, we subdue the Constant before he has time to react. Not that simple. The device is remote triggered. And during uh -huh. his stay on the island, two kill switches have been entrusted to twin sisters Zoe and Sophia Washington. Two young, ambitious Providence operatives and newly appointed chairwomen of the Ark Society. Ah. Apparently, even the Constant is unaware of this arrangement. Right. Change of plans. We divide and conquer. 47 takes out the Washingtons while I figure out a way to get the Constant off the island. It'll be tight, but once we're back at the ship, we should be able this to... This should be an interesting level. The ...before the partners have time to react. 47, tell me about the targets. I know them from the archive. Zoe and Sophia's father is president of a powerful conservative think tank, one of Providence's prime assets. It's a Pax Mundus. The apples don't fall far from the tree. No saints either. According to ICA files, the twins are pampered socialites who get their kicks from the treasure. This is a very good level. Commanding a band of trigger happy mercenaries, Zoe right. and Sophia prowl the world in search for ancient relics. With little regard for local culture or even human life. They stop at nothing to claim their prize. Well, collateral damage they may be, but safe to say, they have it coming. Okay. Now watch me fuck it up. <laughs> I will take some blueberry muffins. Could I have some snacks on the job, boys? 
Alright, we're not doing explosions. We shall take some... We'll take some poo pills. <laughs> oh, nice. Look at the outfit, dude. Let's fucking go. Do not eliminate the constant. There's no way I can kill people with blueberry muffins. There's no fucking way. Maybe I can get them to slip on them. The Isle of Scale. Scale. Headquarters of the Ark Society. Founded by Janus in 1991, the Ark Society is the world's most exclusive club. Its plutocratic members fear the downfall of civilization, and they are willing to pay huge sums to ensure their own survival. Once a year, they gather here to shop the latest survival products and to showcase new initiatives mm. and breakthroughs. Right. These gatherings are shrouded in mystery, so we have limited intel on what to expect on the other side of the walls. The Washington Twins are hosting their first annual gathering as chairwomen of the Ark Society, and the Constant is known to attend every year. Beyond that, you're on your own. I but got you, this. I dare say you're going to need it. Easy. Hello, hello, hello. Sexiest man in the buildings here. Ah, one more, I see. Won't you join us, sir? Just about to begin. Yes. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the annual gathering of the Ark Society. As Ark patrons, you are welcome to explore the castle grounds. However, certain areas are off limits, including the keep, which houses the members' area, convention space, and council meeting. Should you wish to apply for Ark membership, please be aware that such cannot be bought, only earned. All said? Excellent. Follow me, please. So, what do you think? Well, you weren't kidding. This place is pretty epic. Pretty epic. Sir, could you walk a little bit faster, please? You're pretty fucking slow. Maybe I'll just dash on ahead. Hello, everybody. Yes, hello. Ooh. Oh, God, that's posh as fuck. Ugh. I hate it. Ugh, I despise this. Sorry. All right. Sorry. What about here? Wait, someone was... Oh, someone was eating cake in the bathroom. Alright. Alright, let's get to work. <laughs> Overflow the sink. In you go. Okay, that was not not what I wanted. Aha, there we go. That's who I wanted. In you come. Oh. 
There we go. There we go. Now I'm part of the crew. <laughs> Two go in. No, sorry. Three go in. One goes out. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Yeah. How does it work? The tokens are hidden throughout the castle, you know, like out of reach places like the ramparts. And the first initiate to collect enough tokens undergoes a polygraph test with the chairwoman. If you're deemed worthy, you get promoted to arc member. I want to be an arc member. I can do that. So, every year, aspiring arc patrons compete in a treasure hunt to obtain membership status. The first initiate to collect enough tokens undergoes a private screening with Zoe Washington. Which appears to involve a polygraph and electroshock device. Hmm. I suggest you join the fray, 47. A private audience with one of our targets is just what we need. All right. Yeah, I'm not so sure. Depends on your pain threshold, I guess. You can <sighs> Zoe Washington up to 50 here. Word is, she's brought a secret DVD device to us here. Wait, electroshock? Uh, right then. It's just this riddle on my invite. Seek the keepers of the gate in the courtyard they await. What else could it be? No such luck. But some of the Ark members might. I heard a couple of them whispering. They're definitely up to something. Got it. Thanks. All right, let's follow him then. The Phoenix story is a banger. Well, that sounds like it's fire related. <laughs> no, no deal. Now stop bothering me. I'm behind as it is. Huh. Wait a sec. Wait a second. What's she picking up? I can't let you leave, sir. Sir, sir, I can't let you leave. Sir, I, I cannot let you leave. Can I help you? Jesus kind of freaking me out. Man. Uh. I, I, excuse me, but it really freaks me out when people stand too close to me. Look, just stay there. Uh-oh. Catching. Get away from me, you creep. Please, just... Look, guys, 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 guys. Can you smell it? I had beans, and I think they were off. Sorry. Right. Okay. Come on, pork and beans. Can you come? Oh no. Oh no. God damn it. Come on. Oh, That's it. Go to sleep.
There you go, over here. Nobody will find you, it's fine. There we go. Go to sleep. Right there. Wait, that Ark member's gone. It's fine. How many people must I knock out? Okay, next. Actually, I think there's no one around. Okay, who took the money, by the way? Ooh. A key? Very nice. I am staff. And now I will be God. Come on in, buddy. By the way, I should catch up on subs and stuff. I'm sorry, I've... Just... Been so lazy. Actually, it's not even laziness. Um, Demon, thank you for the 150 bits. Hi, Mr. Kyle. Love the streams and vids. Have some bits. Thank you, dude. And thank you for the tier 3 sub for 22 months, by the way, man. Hey. Hey, what kind of guard doesn't investigate the fucking Hoover? Shivan, thank you for being, uh, the Twitch Mind sub for 11 months. Dragon Pit, thank you for the tier 1 sub for 40 months. Kusari, thank you for the Twitch Mind sub for 19 months. And Sandwich, thank you for the Twitch Mind sub for 14 months. Monato, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub for 44 months. TC Tilly, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub for 38 months. Steph Jones, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Arctic Wolf, thanks for being a good egg for 7 months. Kermit's Left Nip, thank you for the tier 1 sub for 7 months. One Bad Kermit and Toxic Senpai, thank you for the Twitch Prime subs, guys. Cody Chapter, thanks for joining the good eggs. And Erimus Rays, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. This ain't working. What the heck? Ooh, Rat Poison. Fuck yeah. I will Okay, so, uh... <laughs> oh, dude, the muffin. I can't even knocked him out instantly. That's nuts. That was class. Why is that a thing? Anyway, let's hide you around here. No one will ever find you. There we go. Good old muffins, am I right? Hello, I'm a god. Hello, everybody. <laughs> god, me, yes. Hmm, wouldn't you want to come in here? You definitely want to come in here, don't you? Come on in. Look at this noise it's about to make. Right. Right. Shit. Okay, 
Let's do this. All right, where's that damn... Ah, okay. Gotcha. Ooh. Hi. Good evening to you. Ah, oh, fuck it. <laughs> okay. Um... Maybe I didn't think that through. Okay, look in the corner. But not phasing through the door. Oh, you have the token I need. Oh, okay. All right, nobody going near. I, <laughs> I took a massive shit. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Wait a second. Wait a little, Koinky Dinky. <laughs> Wait a little, Koinky Dinky. I know where this guy patrols. And I know what he wants. <laughs> Should be like taking candy from a baby. Uh, drop a little token here. Oh, it's going to be the easiest. Oh, I'm so fucking smart. <sighs> and now we wait. He goes over to the table. He has a little chill. And many boys, I'm so fucking stealthy. Here he comes. About to wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's about to see a commemorative token. Wow. Unbelievable. Weird. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you are not getting my commemorative token, my friend. There we go. See? I'm so fucking smart, boys. Oh, there's ten of them I gotta get? Oh, shit. Oh. This guy had quite a few. Well, well, well. Would you recognize me? Your proposal. I couldn't help but overhear. Uh, I'm not sure what you're referring to, Mr. Reaper. Reaper. Your friend wasn't interested, but I am. Hmm. Okay, let's talk. But not here. Follow me. Where are we going? Well, I mean, I mean, <laughs> what the fuck, man? How many, uh, how many fucking bodies have I got to pile up in this fucking room, dude? Alright. Where's the next one? <sighs> Here's what I don't get. Why the mask? It's not like anyone's keeping their identity hidden. So I see these people will recognize me. Somehow. Which is strange because I'm wearing a mask. Let's not question it though, you know. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Real proud of us. Sorry, you're not on my list. Yeah, now get out of here, you idiot. Oh, fuck you, bro. What the tits is that? Oh, 
Huh. Huh. Come here. Why are you listening? I need help. Someone please help me. No, you don't. Oh, he didn't see me go in here, surely. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. He smells the beans. I think he smelled the beans. Yeah. Whoops. It was going very smoothly. I feel like that bathroom shouldn't have gone as smoothly as it did, but somehow it did. Just need four more tokens. It's so weird that people can recognize you. Like, take that guy, for example. He is indistinguishable from me. I uh, I saw some suspicious activity over there. A guy taking pictures wearing a a journalist hat. Yeah, better better check it out. Sorry, sir. This is as far as you go. Chairwoman's order. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Mister, who are you? What do you mean, who am I? They can sense your boldness, yeah. I didn't, I didn't get it. I'm wearing a mask. You're wearing a mask. Oh, fuck. Let's see if I can get him to let me in. Let me in. This is a restricted area, and I can't let you through. Damn. Damn. I mean, I could just walk behind, right? See, that guy's not as smart as I am. All I had to do was sneak on in. Oh shit, is it below? It doesn't matter. Damn, if I could interact with her. Huh. Alright, what we got? I'm gonna be able to take down two of them with a wrench. I got an idea. <laughs> there we go. Now to dispose of my crime. Pretty sure there didn't used to be Marcus for where it was. It was hell. Oh, dude, that does sound like hell. I was going to dump him off the cliff then, but I was like, nah, he shouldn't die. Imagine the last thing you see is a wrench flying past your, your field of view. Crazy.
Right then. We got you, lads. Commemorative token. Don't mind if I do. Hello. I was never here. Oh, I left my wrench behind. Wait, what the fuck? Who the fuck are you? Well, in you go. Take my coin back. Telling me a coin is through there. Careful of the glass. Ah, where's our boy? When you patrol him back here, bro. At least it wasn't a fist as you opened the door. <laughs> Don't know what you're talking about, mate. Where is our boy? Here he comes. Oh, is he trying? He's going to try and get past it. No, here he comes. The chat freeze. Chat always freezes. That's what you're looking for. Yeah, that's what you're looking for, isn't it, bud? Good night, buddy. Yeah, give me those fucking tokens. Woo! One more to go. Good night. All right, one more token. I wonder where the token, like, it's still marked in there, so I wonder if there's one more in there. The hell's that outfit? I'm becoming an initiate into a rich person's cult. Don't mind me, just coming through. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, no, it's just a coin. I'll take my wrench back. A cannonball. Right. I'm not gonna put... <gasps> oh, la la. What do we have here? Secret tunnel. You're the only one here? Yes, you are. What the fuck is this place, bro? Trying to spill the beans, huh? Wait, you had a token? Good work, 47. You've got all the tokens needed to gain access to the initiation. Huh. I suggest you find your way to the screening room. There was an ornate door near the courtyard. Hand in your tokens there. Ooh, a coin. Ooh, a piece of candy. Let's go. Where am I supposed to hide you? I'm sure nobody will come through here. Anyway. You know what? Nah, I don't know what's going on with that. Don't worry about it. 
<laughs> okay. I got a door to knock. Everybody out the way. They're not going to let me go back, are they? Can I go back? Apparently I can. She doesn't know who I are, so you're safe even if she wakes up. That is true. Ooh. Let us in, lads! I got your fucking coins. Here you go, buddy. Congratulations, Initiate. Now the real trial begins. Hey, Miss Washington. An Initiate has completed the treasure hunt. Yeah, understood. Bring him into the interrogation room now. Oh, so, boy. Uh, you think you got what it takes, Initiate? No. You got the stomach for what comes next? No. I can hold my own. Is that so? Honestly. Kind of tough guy? Tough is for amateurs. Welcome, Initiate. Take a seat. Okay. Good. Now pay attention. This is a polygraph machine hooked up to an ECT device. That's short for electroconvulsive therapy, and I assure you it packs quite a punch. In a moment, Ms. Zoe Washington is going to ask you a series of questions, and I suggest you answer truthfully, or the machine will know. Is that clear? Very. Good man. So there's a new Hitman one from years ago. The one from years ago, mate. We're on Hitman 2. Slowly making our way through it. There she is. How the fuck am I gonna take her out? Solid work, 47. Let's see if you can't turn this interrogation to your advantage. So, you made it this far, initiate. I did, yeah. And now, the real test begins. Is the machine operational? The ECT device is set to medium voltage. I don't recommend going higher than that. This setup is still largely untested. Well, as long as the initiate speaks the truth, we won't need to. You could probably shock her. Does my colleague explain the rules to you? Yes. Exhaustively. Good. Um. And do not attempt to deceive me. First question. Are you the best in your field? Yes. Yes. Checks out. <laughs> Very good. Now, are you willing to break the law if required? Yes. True. I see. And can you keep a cool head under pressure? No. Yes. Not lying. Interesting. Well, you're just perfect, aren't you? Maybe a little too perfect. Are you a reporter working for the liberal media? No. Checks out. Well, that's all I needed to hear. Wow, that's fucking easy. Initiate. You have passed the test. Follow me. That was fucking easy. Look at this place. Can I take off this stupid costume yet? They can make fun now. You'll need to dress the part. Over there is your new set of robes. Wear them. Pride. You're one of us now. Congratulations, initiate. Or should I say, ARC member? Wee. Welcome to the big leagues. Nice. Suits you. Okay. Time to join your peers. Follow me. 
As a fully fledged ARC member, you'll have special privileges. Yeah. First offer on our top suites and bunkers, early access, Ooh. you name it. Uh, would you Ooh. like to be on the first ship to Titan? Well, you can now. Fascinating. Wait. Are they talking about Titan as in like course, a different planet? Privilege comes responsibility. You are expected to invest in future projects approved by the council and to donate to the Ark of Legacy. Not a problem. I'm very accountable. That's what I like to hear. In fact, a man as the moon of Saturn could prove useful in other matters. We should discuss the precise nature of your business, but that's for later. So they're scamming. A further now. It's a scam. <laughs> It's not actually. It's a scam. They're just super rich like that. Yeah, but are they gonna be able to survive there? I'm not really sure about that one. Well, here we are. Goodbye, initiate. And, uh, welcome to the big leagues. Wait, where are you going? Hmm. Clouds. Certainly wouldn't want to be fighting you for the last month in the himself. It was lost for over 500 years until Blake Nathaniel unsealed the serpent's tomb. Extraordinary piece of flipping necklace. Anyway, the Washington twins found it first. Way I hear it, Sophia oh, literally man, has the necklace in her hand when Nathaniel repels from the ceiling, triggers this ancient death trap, and, you know, murder and mayhem ensues. But, Blake. I thought those two were and what are you lovers. To be? A lion tamer? Currently way off, which explains the added security. Mm -hmm. I don't follow it. Think about it. Why? So, according to its charter, the Ark Society collects priceless art and historical artifacts in case of a global disaster. And this year, world famous treasure hunter Blake Nathaniel has <laughs> donated an Aztec necklace called the Cloud oh. to the Ark Society's growing collection. However, Blake fears that Sophia Washington, his former lover and rival, who has hunted the Cloud Serpent for years, will attempt to steal it for herself before it goes into storage. Hmm, could be just the bait we need. It's a little on the nose, just a little bit. The need for an alarm system. Where oh, filthy rich. Oh, steal the fucking necklace. Okay, let's follow the wires. Jeez, made this one a bit obvious, didn't I? That's on you, Blake. So where can I go? Where am I? Am I allowed to go upstairs? Oh fuck yeah. That's him, the constant. That's our boy. Providence's top controller. Everything depends on capturing him alive. Arkins are not allowed back here. Sorry. I see a window. Do you even know who I am, sir? This is staff only. I'm sorry, sir. Sir, you look like me. Uh, can I help you? You're kind of freaking me out. Right. Just have a little snoop around. Huh. Why is there a people? Do you know who I am? The thing people who deserve respect always say. Mate, the people that say do they say do you know who I am? No motherfucker, you're in a fucking mask. <laughs> Although apparently they recognize me. Uh oh, Ebs is angry. I'm up here now. I'm gonna turn this off. I'm gonna kill this employee. 
I'm gonna take her shit. Wait. There's a woman. Damn it! Where's that a guy? Oh, it's a guy! Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, I did it again. I'm gonna get zero stars. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck you. Oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Gonna have to do it again, I think. Okay, cut the red or the blue red. Hello, everybody. It is me. That is Sophia Washington, chairwoman of the Ark Society, professional treasure hunter, and Providence operative. Quite the resume. We'll have to pad you down if you're coming this way, sir. Oh, not yet. Hang on. Ah. <laughs> uh. Uh, there we go. Any other legal items on me? Ooh, yes. A Bartoli. I gotta get rid of that one, too. Don't even know if I said that right, boys. The cannonball is fine, though. Can you go on one mission without accidental murder? No. Hi, guys. I know, like, I know you said you were gonna frisk me and I walked away and then came back, but I assure you, I just had stage fright. I had to Thank mentally you prepare myself for you to touch my balls. Please continue. Thank you, Apple. <laughs> now, the question is... Why have I come up here? For I do not even know myself. Kind of embracing the dark urge. Yeah. In my defense, I really did not mean to kill him. Well, I have to agree. Tripping up the climate effort has served us well so far. Oh, good to see you, sir. I'm missing a key card. Not a problem. Where am I going? Bye-bye. Well, back to zero stars. <laughs> God fucking damn it. Well, may as well do all trusty. Well, anyway, in you go. Same for you. Can't take any chances. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck is this? Castle Master Key. <laughs> I can't do it. 
<sighs> Don't worry about your armor that went missing. Can the armor block bullets? Good evening, sir. I don't know. Even if the council can't come to an agreement, we all know which Weird. Hey guys. Bet you're wondering how I got from there. What did I even go upstairs for? I'm it doesn't matter. However, I do now have free reign to go anywhere I please. Except near that guy. Hello, Shaggers. By the way, I'm fairly sure it's on this map where if you kill absolutely everyone except constant, the night armor comes alive and tries to kill you. That would be sick. How do I get back downstairs? It's not going to be worth a damn thing if you're caught. Ah. You know that Fuzz Delgado had a really interesting collection of artworks. Oh yeah, we're on the right track. We are on the right track. I don't know what they see in that ad. That thing meant something. Right. Uh, hello, sir. How do I pull this off? Think. Got the wrench. I got a plan. I got a plan. I got a plan, boys. I got a plan. Stupid plan. No way. It was a fucking genius plan. Take aim. Hey, I'm just ready to be. This guy's fucking deaf. In you go. Anyway. Take aim. Oh, Stan's ready to me too. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it was funny. I'm going to beat your ass if you don't get seven TV emotes on your channel. Bonk. Okay. Yeah. Have the, the right emotes. I'm sorry. Yeah, you better be. It's so bad that that works so well. Right. We turn off the security. And now, I somehow have to steal that necklace in front of everybody. Who the fuck are you? You stand out like a sore thumb, my dude. I mean, I can't just... I can't take it. I see, I see. Hello, everybody. Say what? Think. 
How do I distract this? I've got coins, right? <laughs> yeah. I just think it's a pity they don't have the really big <laughs> Just laughing at you. I mean, it's not out of reach. The case is open. What was that? The lights are off. God damn it! <laughs> how, do, how do I take this? <laughs> Shit. I need a big distraction and I'm trying to think what I could distract them with. Because the coin ain't doing it. <laughs> it was almost slick, I'll give it that. Just being a right dick right now. Oh! Oh! Mwah. Oh my god! Ooh! That was so good. Oh! That's Blake Nathaniel. Serpent is safe from what sticky fingers. When did you get it? Take care, sir. That was actually it was so good, what a distraction upon distraction. Where we going, bud? Huh? Where we going? You're Blake Nathaniel, right? But if you don't mind me asking. People have been searching for the Cloud Serpent for centuries. Wherever did you find it? Well, to cut a long story short, it began with a Portuguese galleon salvaged off the coast of Costa Rica. One of the long dead sailors had a tattoo etched into the back of his neck, and it spoke of a map to the mythical Serpent's Tomb, hidden inside the royal scepter of Montezuma. The only problem was the scepter, which was stolen by Cortez's troops after the fall of Tenochtitlan, now belong to Esteban Montoya, head of the Moreno drug cartel. Council still in Safe to say that was, uh, called a recess. That was the field Washington. I'm gonna let him talk for a bit. Motion, but one of the council members is fighting her tooth and nail. Huh. Wouldn't happen to be Jebediah Block, the coal baron, would it? Yeah. How do you know? Well, I happen to know he's on the council. He's one of the original five. You know, the first people to fund the Ark Society back in 91. She. I just walked in on some Thea Washington then. Not to mention, I earn it. It was still going? Solve those damn puzzles rather than just see for my way through them. Zoe and Sophia have no respect for the craft or or for ancient architecture. Still, Sophia's one hell of a woman. Ah, yes. That must be hard. The rivalry. <clears throat> yeah, well, uh, love and war, miss. Love and war. Nice, nice that you're done talking. Where are you going now, Nathaniel? Back down here. You don't walk in a fucking circle now, do you? When are they gonna notice it's gone? That's a good point. Don't mind me, sir. <laughs> we 
we go on bed? Man, this place is fucking posh. Where are we going? Ooh. Gonna go check on it, are we? Because it's not there. Oh my god, you really do walk in a circle, don't you? Uh oh. Take aim. Wait a minute. Hey, Kali rated me as well. Thank you, man. Uh, what the hell are you doing? You! This is Nathaniel. What am I looking at? Why, that's the... Oh, my. But it's gone. It can't be. What, the alarm is... Expertly disabled, I assume. But there was someone here the whole time. And besides, stealing from the Order? No ARC member would be so... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe one of the custodians took it to be polished. Or... Oh, oh, no, no, no. I know exactly what happened. Or who happened. You? Who's the culprit? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. All right, I'll take care of this. Back to work. Or whatever your the hell it is you do around you here. honor us for your presence. Man? Yeah. I'm gonna Zoe, back did you put her up to this? Did I put her up to this? Uh-oh. How delightfully obscure. You know what I'm talking about. Someone took the cloud serpent, and I think we both know who. You think Sophia... <laughs> oh, Blake. You dumb son of a bitch. Are you saying she doesn't want it? Of course she wants it. But she wants it from you. What's that supposed to mean? You figure it out. I don't have the time or the crayons to explain it to what you. What a dense man. Men. Good evening, Zoe. Wow. How does the one guy not wearing a mask still come across... Jesus the Christ, this is a fucking party year, isn't it? So... Hello, sir. I hear you. Exciting. If there's one thing oh my I've god, his fucking voice, dude. It's to have a I hear you've taken steps to make the initiation more... Oh, but I do. Mm. In fact, exciting. Quite indubiously quiet. Hmm, let's see. I trusted you. Poor sportsmanship. Yada, yada, yada. Uh... What are we gonna knock you out with? Are there any coins? I got a cannonball. The fuck are they doing in there? Do I knock him out right here, right here, right now? Where's a good place to knock him out? Oh, it's me. Today, sir. Thank you. Looking sharp, sir. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. <sighs> Old trusty. Cannibal. <laughs> Go on, buddy. I'm sure nobody will notice you. Was that? Uh, someone's been hurt. Damn. Uh, all right, hang on. I'm gonna get someone. of the perpetrator. We're hunting blind. God damn it. God damn it. How dare you? I never got to see the perpetrator. Don't make me do this. Roger, command. Nothing tangible yet. Still looking. Will you? I strongly suggest you... Mm. 
Anyway. Hey, what's up, baby? Sir. Sophia. Blake, I almost didn't recognize you without a knife in my back. I messed up. I see that now. Can we talk? <laughs> this should be good. Follow me. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, hi, how are you? Greetings, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Sophia, we gotta go. We gotta go, Sophia. Come on, move. Move. Before they rile you up. Come on, get a move on. Oh, dude, that god knows what I fucking look like. He's still unconscious for now, though. How does it feel that you're going to be murdered by the man that you love? <laughs> Enjoy your night. You've got one minute. I'm feeling... Uh, I did wrong by you, Sophia. Very vulnerable I today. I see that now, so and I want uh, to make amends. Back off. Here, this is rightfully yours. Well, well. Look who comes crawling Well, back. well, well. Leave us. You know, we lost three men because of you. Wickus was crushed by a rolling boulder. Jaco fell into a pit trap. And Zoe and me, we only escaped the arrows by using one of the local guides as a human shield. Now, this is a nice gesture, but it doesn't even begin to make amends. I know. May I? Fine. But not too tight. You know, I thought about sending the boys after you. Grab the necklace and cut your throat ear to ear. You probably wonder why I didn't. The truth is, you beat us, Blake. I don't deny. Oh my God. Oh, she died pretty quick. One target down. Nice work, Peterson. Next up, Zoe Washington. Ah! 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 What are you doing here? Oh, box. Box. Box, 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 box. Into the box. Into the box, into the box, into the box. Good night. Why is he there? Why is he there? Oh shit. A remote trigger. Must be a kill switch. <sighs> mm. I bet this would make the constant come quietly. But first things first, Waterson. Focus on the top. Oh. You guys knew the moment I saved the game, didn't you? You, you guys knew. <laughs> you got shot before the mission failed. Hell yeah, I did. Yeah. I bet this would make the constant come quietly. But first things first, forty-seven. Focus on the target. Is the money not like? What the hell is this thing? Right. The hell is that? Ah, just the man I wanted to see. Really? Close the door.
Here we go. Oh shit! Got him. There we go. I'll also take that. Thank you very much. There we go. Now nobody recognizes me. Except him down there. I guess. What is that? Is that some kind of teleporter? Ah, right. It's part of the night challenge. Um, so there's my next target. And that guy still remembers what I look like. Okay. Don't worry about that. Uh, what was that one intel that I got? I heard them talking. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Fuck it, we'll do the Phoenix. I know you guys were talking about that. Hi guys, it's me, Nathaniel. A bit of a legend around these parts. <laughs> Run right into him! Very awkward. Now I'm super compromised. Or am I? <laughs> Back to my original costume, baby. Hello? Hello, everybody. Hey, I saw him go that way. Nice. Very nice. Anyone down here recognize me, that guy? Someone is causing a public commotion. There's been a lot of public commotions today, isn't there? Doesn't seem like this event's going very smooth, guys. Hope you're having a good one. Far out, bro. Genesis Mahdi is gonna be prepped in the basement. Uh -oh. Check the wake schedule. The service opens with a performance of Janice's favorite Schubert piece. Zobie Washington delivers a short eulogy, and then guests are invited to pay their last respects. The plan is to keep the body on display for the duration of the evening, so even if you miss the service, you can still say goodbye. Me too, old friend. Me too. Uh okay. Huh. Why have they got a loaded cannon? Or like... Sorry, rather, why have they got a cannon that is actually functional? No fucking clue where we get the gunpowder from though. Uh-oh. 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 Jenny, why is there a cannon aiming at it? Right, what is this up here that we're doing? Phoenix ceremony. 
symbolizes the collapse of civilization from which the Ark Society emerges unscathed and triumphant. Ah, rebirth. I Interesting. Guess. Zoe Washington is going to partake in a ceremony symbolizing the downfall of civilization from which the Ark Society will emerge unscathed. Apparently, a giant phoenix-shaped effigy is set on fire with Zoe inside it. Well, I suggest you locate this master of ceremonies who lights the fire 47. If this doesn't sound like an accident waiting to happen, I don't know what does. Sounds like she's going to die regardless, I guess. What's new is that the master of ceremonies will light the effigy on fire with Zoe Washington inside it. Huh. A bit showy, wouldn't you say? Hey, whatever sells. Oh. Okay. Oh, fuck, did you not see me? I don't see nothing to worry about. Hey, you! What are you doing wandering around here where you're not allowed? Sorry, I got lost. I got lost. Ah, drop the gun. Understood? Ah, I didn't realize I picked. Let me see your hands. Nice and slow, buddy. Hands behind. Oh no! Right. At that. Stay where you are. Stay. Stay. Stay where you are. Get down on the ground. Get down on the ground. You. Where are you? And why are you running? Oh fuck! Oh. You really don't have many survival instincts, do you? If you're running away from a guy with a gun! I've lost her. <laughs> Alright, here's the plan. <laughs> the fucking clunk! Oh no! <laughs> I did it again! Oh. Well, there's the fire. I died to the fire. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> the fucking, the fucking sound his head made when it hit the bar. Oh, that's so good. Dunk. <laughs> I can't I accidentally fucking murder the guy again with the whole. Uh... Oh, can I reach a token? Ah, fuck it. Hey. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> I can't help myself. Oh, hang on. Right. I see. What's up, dudes? It's me. Oh, God, that's a hostile area. All right. This is not the way. So fucking good. Right, time for old trusty. Hello. Yes, hello. Whoa. 
One. Two. Here we go. Pick up my wrench. Did I do that too early? Nah. Okay, back is an ARC member. Going up. Hey, what's it to you, brother? I'm a special ARC member. I'm not a special ARC member. <laughs> what do you mean combat? Excuse me. We're fucking who? Oh, that guy. Eh, he won't find me. in a circle, does it not? Oh, I'm so smart. <laughs> and I'm in. The, uh, the wrench trick isn't gonna work here, lads. I should have stayed as a technician. Again! Oh, I am super compromised right now. I got this, boys. I got this. Ah, oh, where'd he go, boys? Fuck, that's crazy. Security breach. I need you to move now. Gotcha. Loud and clear. We have a security breach. Just get out of our way. Oh shit. Oh, no, 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 Help me. Somebody help me. Okay, I might be able to slip through here. Right behind them. Wait, they're going in there? Right. Evening. Aha, they're going right through. <sighs> ah. Old trusty? Yeah, I'll 
deal with this. You just hang back. Okay, thanks. Huh. Huh. No way. Don't move. I'll be back with someone to help. Now I could do old trusty. There we go. I'm sure nobody's gonna walk in here. Just dispose of these. We are good. Ooh, there's files on the laptop. All right. Come on, buddy. Let's move you out the way, eh? Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> oh, this game is ridiculous, man. All right, let's read these files. Begin the ceremony. What's up, you fucking losers? <laughs> What's this here? I feel like that's a very important button. Hello, everybody! Hello! Let's get this started, shall we? Really, it's a money pit. I can't believe I didn't notice that. A handsome pledge, and yet a drop in the ocean. Oh, we learnt the script. What do you mean, searching? Who's searching? What happened up there? This is going to be super fucked up. Oh. Zoe Washington, the Ark Society recognizes you as our founder's rightful successor, our inspiration, our guiding light, the custodian of our future. Excellent work, Fortison. Enjoy the spotlight. I am. I'm loving it. Patrons of the Ark Society, you are part of a select, chosen few. Our founder, Janus, showed us how to survive. But survival is not enough. We must live, and we must soar. The Ark Society must not only commit itself to survival, but to progress. Be it our next home in the stars, or He's the a red next chitter. step in human evolution. This is the eternal purpose of the elite. Not just to lead, but to lead from the front. When the time comes, and all comes tumbling down, when mankind retreats once more into caves of superstition, we will keep the fire alight. We will be the torchbearers, the trailblazers and pioneers. Do, do not feel guilty for your privilege. Be proud. Be fearless. For the future is ours to shape. So, oh yeah, those two are in each other. <laughs> Hello, sir. Uh, are you going in? Look at you, Fenneger. All dressed to kill. Yeah. Light her up. Well, as the world burns, we rise from its ashes, not just to survive, but to live. 
there. How is she supposed to survive this? Oh, was she meant to go out the back? Oh, right. Bruh. Bruh. So she was supposed to walk in, the front door closes, the back door opens. Hello, sir. Hello. Yikes. Washington's are dead. I have the kill switch. What did you say? How could you know about that? You will head towards the harbor. No sudden moves. No signs or warnings. I will trigger the device if I need to. Good to, to. see ya. I know you. The boy in the picture. You have his eyes. Uh-oh. You're Brian Woods' assassin. Right next to him? You are walking around with a fucking torch. Yeah, but you know, it kind of fits on this island, doesn't it? I had a notion something didn't sit right with my mentor's betrayal. You murdered him, I take it, to get to me. Not just that. He had it coming. Interesting. It was my impression that you were cured of such sentiment. The good doctor built his serum specifically to target the seats of your emotions. Has Miss Burnwood's sense of justice rubbed off on you? I wonder. Just keep walking. Fuck, that was close. Would you stop investigating? I will kill... Huh. <laughs> oh, I really don't fit in here. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Oh, it's the fucking torch. Uh... No. Still no. Uh, got me an outfit in here. God. Still no. Oh, mm, yes. Maybe just a little hop skit. A, oh. Smooth. Very smooth. <laughs> Think you broke the conversation? Well, you know, it is what it is. For fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. There we go. We did it. Now get in the boat. I have to leave my calling card behind. This is the day you almost caught me, you silly bastards. <laughs> Taken out by a newspaper. <laughs> He's still got the gun pointed at me. Nailed it. As clean as it is, as clean as it gets. Jesus, how many different ways can you do these missions, man? What the fuck?
What's that one with the old looking guy? And ready, zero stars. Why was there a squeaky toy then? Oh, boys, leaderboards global. I just... I just came 94,000th out of 94,307. I am one of the worst players in the world. Like, that's impressive. I am one of the worst players who has ever done that mission. There is only 302 people worse than me. The higher the number, the better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Impressively bad. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How do I see the friends list? Oh. Oh, look at me. I'm in the bottom, baby. <laughs> what was it that did me in? Non-targets. I think it was just a lack of XP as well. So it was non-targets and a lack of XP of doing stuff. I noticed kill. Nah. Target eliminated. Who fucking knows? Ah, friends. Wow. Jesus Christ, Beaver did that really well. And oop. I could have a morning star. Isn't there a lot of hackers in the game that make their time zero that up to score? Is score based on time? That did take me a while. Five stars guaranteed if you never get spotted in a wrong outfit or trespass in. <laughs> Mr. Edwards. Still think this is maintenance. Oh, Miss Burnwood. What have you done? Change. You knocked out and killed so many people, yeah. Dream? Truly unprofessional. You know what we want. I thought you get points for knocking people out, though. Where is the carrot? No carrot. You're useless to the partners. Compromised. Even if we let you live, not if it's you can noticed. never return. Okay. Why die protecting them? When I can drag them down with me. It's a bad hand, but it's all you've got. Yeah, if you kill them, I knew that one. Three families. That's all it took. The Ingrams, the Carlisles, the Stuyvesants. Three dynasties secretly pooling their resources over generations, creating a singularity so dense that nothing escapes its gravity. What are you and waffling on about? Well, they've heard of you. In fact, you just became the top of their agenda. Go. We can't give them time to retaliate. Don't take your eyes off him. I want to see Kev do one of the challenges where he does the night Be part. Careful. Is that dressing up as the night well, or is that killing someone as the night? Here we are again. I did see there was an Iron Maiden up there. I must admit I am disappointed, Miss Burnwood. I had, I had such, such big plans, plans for you. you. Save it. I know the truth now. Such a nasally played. weird voice. You have nothing left to bargain with. <laughs> you were so certain. So sure of the people. Killing everyone and fighting the night. Just as a night, I made in as a different kill he? method. Okay. He never misses his mark. You found a window into his past. And yet, something else remains hidden. A simple truth you learned long ago. Diana. Coming. No Jesus Christ, how old is he? Miss Burnwood is untouchable.
He knows. He is also a genetically modified clone. Was that the end of Hitman 2? Seems like it was. No? Originally, yes. Okay. Does the, um... Oh, the DLC gives it a better one. Okay. Yeah, we'll do this again next week, boys. I think I'll end it there. It is um, 3 a.m. in the UK. <laughs> yeah. You liking the new setup, boys? I think I'm liking the new setup. Where are you going? Hey. Where are you going? Well, good night then. <laughs> I like this view of Fanny Taller and Kaif, yeah. Alright, yeah, we'll end the stream there, boys. I need to... Oh, yeah, my my legs needed that stretch. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. Full screen. Oh, God, look at the back of my hair. It's getting so fucking long. Jesus. And I need a shave. Do you guys like my... uh Wrong hand. How good is that? How fucking good is that poster? Fantasy Kai's actual height is a goblin. True. But yeah, we'll end the stream there, boys. Here's a great poster. Get a mullet. No, never happening. Never happening. I missed some notifications as well. Um, Pandox, thank you for 150 bits. Damn, boy, you frying chicken in there. You couldn't hear my piss. Shut the fuck up. That guy, thank you for the T1 sub for 52 months. Vincent Frost, thank you for the T1 sub for 45 months. Nightmare, thank you for the Twitch mindset. Welcome. Dark Dragon, thank you for the 150 bits. Have you found the bird staff yet? No. Oh, yeah, I know what made. Okay. Axmo, thank you for the T1 sub for 14 months. And thank you for the five gift subs that you gave out, man, on Twitch as well. Thank you so much, dude. Tom, thank you for the Twitch mindset for 35 months. Amethyst, thank you for the being a good egg for a year. Uh, Tia Vidar, thank you for the T1 sub for 45 months. Krozak, thank you for the Twitch mindset for 31 months. Cheers to my favorite streamer. Thanks to all the entertainment, Kai, for new problem, man. Um. Venic, thanks for joining the good eggs. Neopolitan, thank you for the T1 sub for 33 months. Neum, thank you for the T1 sub for 5 months. Practically a skeleton, thank you for the T1 sub for 26 months. Um, Venic, thank you for being a Twitch Prime sub for 11 months. And Goose, no Goose Natos, thanks for being a T1... Sorry, thanks for being a good egg for 9 months. Mullet Kaif, no Mullet Kaif, bad. Alright, yeah, we'll end it there. It's a poster of me. Oh, yeah, you are a goose. Uh, what are we doing tomorrow? Ah, League of Legends. Yeah, it's going to be an earlier stream, boys. Um, should be very salty for the enemy team because I'm probably going to play Teemo again. But it'll be a good laugh. I know a lot of people are like, oh, my God, League of Legends. But uh, it's, it's super funny. <laughs> All right. Guys. Thank you for joining the stream. If you subscribed or resubscribed, if you sent in bits, if you donated, if you bought merch, if you lurked. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow for some League. And then uh, we have, uh, what's it called? Lethal Company on Friday. I'm going to go lay the fuck down. I'm tired. But we'll do uh, we'll do a Hitman next week. I'm really enjoying it. I want to complete it. And I think I'll go back and do the uh, Hitman 1 DLC and the Hitman 2 DLC before we do Hitman 3. Anyway. Bye guys, thanks for joining.